There we go. How loud is it? Looks pretty quiet. Look at Bulbasaur! That's like better art than what's in the other fucking Game Boy Color games. I guess it's one still. I guess Gold and Silver had some fucking nice looking stuff. We got some Gen 2 starters. We got Pikachu. That's the one from his card. One of his cards. That's rad! Oh my god, Machoke, what? I asked Mew from one of the cards. It's like the first Mew. Let me ask him on the cards. I guess all these were from the cards, but I don't actually remember a lot of the dark cards and the rocket cards. Oh, let's see what's going on. I can make a girl! It's the same protagonist as one. I gotta make a girl. My name has to be in Japanese! Ah. Alright. Let's be... Sa... Ku... Why did you soccer? I could have done Elena. Eight Club Masters. So I've never ever played this game. But I do like the original a lot. This is the forgotten Pokemon game. I've never played it because it's never been in English before. This is a translated ROM. Whoa, it's the same world! They going around fucking stealing Pokemon from the clubs or something? Or cards, I guess. Are Pokemon real in this universe? I guess they're not, right? Team Great Rocket. Okay, they're stealing the cards. Whoa, am I getting fucking abducted? I just got spun. Oh, did this steal all of my cards because I'm the same guy as the first game? Yep. They changed the overworld layout a little bit. I think the water club is different, and then they've got this thing over here, the GR base. Even Sakura's cards were stolen. Dr. Mason. Okay, so yeah, my cards were stolen. Hi. It's interesting that we're in the same overworld. Ronald! I'm your longtime rival, Ronald. Alright, do we have Gen 2 Pokemon in this game? I actually have no idea. I know it goes beyond... The first game only had Jungle, Fossil, and Base Set. And then there was Base Set 2. And then there was, I think, Rocket Cards? Dark Cards? And then Gym Leader Cards, I think. Oh, and that was the default. Take this deck. What the fuck? I didn't get to choose it? Are you kidding me? The first game let you choose between three different decks. There's going to be a lot of new cards for me, so I'm going to have to do some learning. A little weird that my name is the only thing in Japanese. Starter deck. It's fire. Fire and fighting. Charmander, Charmeleon, Growlithe. It's very organized, holy shit. Are you kidding me? This is so much neater than the, the deck in the first game. I've only got four. Hi. Different versions of ST. There's a mode in the Switch version that lets you copy oh, control view in first person with motion controls. That sounds cursed as hell. Let's look at these cards, because I don't know if they're the same. That's the same. The art looks great. That's a new Growlithe! It's cute! I have no idea what that emblem is on the right there. Is my mouse visible? Yeah. Look at this thing. Is that a Squirtle? Kind of looks like a Squirtle. I don't know what it means though. Charge? Charge is a move in Pokemon, but it's like charge like electricity. This is just a charge like tackle. Okay, 20 damage, but only half chance of working. And then, oh, that card looks annoying to use. I better, this only works in a deck with a lot of fire energies. The puppy Pokemon. Brave and trustworthy nature. Did you guys know that the Pokemon Growlithe does not, even into the current gen, learn the move Growl? Growlithe does not learn Growl. In no Pokemon game can you have a Growlithe with Growl. You also can't get a Gabite with Bite. I think there's a couple of the weird ones. Uh, Aurora didn't learn Aurora Veil until recently, or maybe it still doesn't have it. 
Uh, Flareon didn't have uh, Flare Blitz until very recently. I think Gen 7 or Gen 6. I don't remember. It got it eventually. I mean, it's just like their English names. You know, it's not called Growlithe in Japan. Ponyta? That's the Ponyta I'm aware of. It's, it's quite a good card. Having to use two energies to set up, or I mean to attack, is kind of bullshit. Um, Charmeleon's decent. Charmander is decent. Diglett, that's the Diglett I know. Glorious color, dude. They look great. How did the sprite work get so much better, even though it's the same pictures? This much up is good. 50 HP, 1 energy to do 20 damage. Fighting type is quite useful. This is a great card. Uh, I never was a huge fan of this one, but I think it's quite decent. It's kind of annoying. It's got 80 HP, and then Karate Chop does less damage, the more health you lose. So it's 50, and then can go down to fucking 0. And then the other one, uh, you do 20 damage to yourself. So if you're at low health, you've got an attack that does 0 damage, or an attack that kills you, which is just goofy as hell. Uh, there's some overlap. Certain Pokemon have the same name. For example, Pikachu. Um... It's usually pretty obvious what the ones that are the same are. Plus, the legendaries usually have the same name in all versions. Like, all versions. So, like, it's always a uh, Kyogre, for example, I think. It's always a Xerneas. It's always a Mewtwo. Rattata and Raticate? Raticate? Yeah, it's this one. One energy. Beautiful. One energy, 20 damage bite. Same with this guy. So these are all... What the fuck is this? Peck and Wing Attack. <laughs> There's nothing. There's nothing. Very straightforward. This is like the most straightforward card I've ever seen. 40 HP sucks. Resist Ground is kind of good. That's a cute Meowth. It's got like a little Bulbasaur on the side. Bruh. Bite and Fury swipes. Damage potential of 30. Average damage 15, I guess. That's technically better than Bite. Could be worse. It's worse one um, eighth of the time. Right? Doodle. This little fly in my room. I kill it instead. Energy retrieval's good. Potion's good. Gust of Wind is good. Switch is good. Bill is good. I know all those cards. I got fire and fighting energies. This deck looks fine. I'm a little bit mad because it's just... It, they just gave me the one deck. Alright, let's try not to hold the speed key non-stop like I always do. Oh, the, the place is bigger. What we got? What's your deal? Training room. Practice duels. Several steps in our training program. I already know how to play the game. Can't look at the computer. Aaron. Yeah, I already know how to play this shit. You had a force tutorial in the last game, so this is way better. I guess I'll look at the step one of the tutorial. Go, go, go. That guy's ugly. I'm cute. Okay, so I got Dratini. Dude, this fly is fucking okay. It's dead. I think I escaped the first time. Um, I would play. I would play Goldina a hundred times out of a hundred here. Which Dratini is this? I should have looked at it. It's that Dratini. This Dratini sucks dick. It's 40 HP with one attack that does 10 damage. And no secondary effect. It's a horrible... Horrible Dratini. Whoa! Silver coin. Chansey. Is that heads? So this just looks like a regular... Hitmonchan! That card is fucking good. Oh, I don't want to see that. Oh, that's a new Bulbasaur. Tackle and Razor Leaf. Oh, looks like a quite decent card. And a fully grass deck. How much HP? Four. Oh, that's not that great. I would have rather had five. Little differences like that make a big difference overall. Well, let's horn attack this guy. That Himonchan is one of the best cards in old Pokemon. This thing's going to kick my ass. Good thing I have the Seeking. That card just gets so much damage so fast. Charmeleon. I don't have a Charmander. Um, I guess I'll play the Seeking. I don't know which deck this is, because my deck doesn't have a Dratini in it. So, like, I don't know if my fire cards are precious. 
I guess they are because I have a Charmeleon, right? So I'll probably draw a Charmander at some point. I'll just use the Water Energy. Waterfall. Alright, this is quite good actually. Did you know that Sea King can have Lightning Rod ability as of Gen, I think, 3 and beyond? Definitely at least Gen 5. It's an electric, t I mean, it's a water. T oh, no, 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 no! I did not need to see that. He used a potion. Fuck, I'm dead in two hits. I thought I was going to kill it this turn. This game is slow. I guess I should put an energy on my fucking Dratini. Don't know which one to put on it. I probably should have put a fire energy on it, but it's whatever. I need to draw a Charmander stat. If I can draw a Charmander, I'll win. Belbazor. I don't know what to do with all these fire energies. This is a tutorial battle, is it always the same? Fire energy. So he should kill me right now. Which he did. He's got like a fucking... Oh, there's the Trimander. GG. How many prizes? Four. Um, no reason not to build it up right now. It's going to win the whole game for me, especially because he's apparently got a grass deck of some kind. Bill, William. Oh no, I'm using super speed too much. The Rattata is good too. Time to not build it up and instead build up the Charmander. He's going to put another energy on the Spearow and then kill me. Oh, he he did, but he didn't. What we got? Oh, a Star U. Uh, I would have liked more water energies. Professor Oak I don't like. I can just go ahead and evolve this Rattata. I could save this. Is it worth saving? Fuck it, I'll do it. It's one retreat cost, right? Gen 5 hidden ability. Alright. We're in. Eat the Spiro. Another fire energy. It's probably four fire energy prizes, given that... Um, Oh, this this is gonna do a lot. I'm weak to this guy. Make this Charmeleon buff. I see no reason to play the Professor Oak. I should probably learn about this um, Ivysaur while I got the chance. Leech Seed probably drains 10 HP. Find what probably just does damage. Yeah. Okay. Well. Super straightforward, I should have an easy win. Unless he draws some bullshit right now. Lantern is a much better Pokemon than Seeking. And actually most water types are better than Seeking. Alright, so this thing is probably weak to fire, even though I didn't actually verify that. And it's probably going to get nuked into orbit right now. Let's send it straight to hell. Yep. So my last prize. That wasn't even like a tutorial. That was just a regular battle. The sad animation. Or not animation, but picture. is so goofy looking. They must have outsourced that one to a fucking intern. Okay, I get Dex. Or... Dex packs. Cute Meowth. It's all energies! No, it's an energy pack. I'll do those later. I don't need energies, I need cards. Wait. Be careful. Yeah, I'm good. So the last game had various missable cards. The airport. So you have to save a lot. Here's Ronald. Look at these characters on the ground. 
This might have been the first game and then removed for the international version. Sighting in the Rock Club. I guess it wants me to do that one first. Card pop to get some new cards. Okay, so we're doing a pretend card pop. I got a Mew. It's funny, they thought multiple people would own this game. What the fuck is a Minicom? I'm so cute. 441 cards in this game. The last game had 200 and something. It's like 220, I think. 226. Michael, member of the Fighting Club. <laughs> we can only fight back by playing Pokemon cards. A few new cards. Michael was in the last game. They're reusing a lot of assets. I'm not mad, though. I should have played this game years ago. Holy shit, this just looks like better than the original one. The graphics are nicer. Damn it. Uh, I don't have any fucking... I can't... I can't do anything! I can't do anything! Alright, I can do something with that. This Machop is useless. It's the fucking... It's the worst Machop in history. However, the uh, Ponyta is going to do some work. The Spearow might also do some work if I'm lucky. Alright, the Pikachu hurt itself, which was incredible for me. Because now I one-shot it. Two Charmeleons? So I could just kill the Pikachu. I could also attack the Meowth, the Eevee, or the Machop. This is actually really dire. I need to draw like a Charmander. Fury swipes. He got one heads. He should have sent out the Machop, I feel. I can't not hold the fucking speed button. Okay. Potion is good. I don't see a better time to use that than now. Kill this thing. Another fire energy. Those are good. Charmeleon. I've got three of them. That's like every Charmeleon in my deck. I'm surprised he hasn't gone to the Machop. Oof. Ah. I guess I'll play the Machop. My finger is just touching the speed key. I can't help it. I just want to speed along. More fire energies. Okay, that's a little dire. With with my Spearow, I think I win. Because Spearow will kill it. I think. I actually should go to the Spearow now, but if I have a retreat cost of two, I don't want to do that. It's one. I could do it. It's not a horrible move. Because my Spearow doesn't take any damage from Machop. My Spearow is actually just going to win this whole fight for me. I can just go into it. This Spearow is fucking invincible. Does he even have... He has normal Pokemon. Yeah. Normal Pokemon can fuck me up. I will wing attack this Machop. Oh no. Oh no, I'm going to die. Oh, I've only got one prize left. Okay, this was close. I can just gust of wind him back into the Machop and then kill it. Oh my god. I was one turn from losing. I have a Machop, but Machop needs fighting energies. And I didn't have any. And if my Machop dies, he draws his last prize. Or also if my Spearow dies. Spearow coming in clutch. It's kind of ugly. Right, you? What the fuck is this? That's decent. I hate that. I will never use that card. Another fire energy and another Charmeleon is quite good. One fucking pack? Give me two! Man in hat. Hat kid. Like fucking um, hat in time. The coolest Pokemon? I don't know. 
It would be a Pokemon wearing shades. Are there any Pokemon that wear shades? I can't think of any. All dark Pokemon can wear black glasses. I mean, any Pokemon can wear black glasses. Hey, Mon Lee. For a Mewtwo. Crocodile has something that's kind of like shades. Where's my text notepad? So, this is the Fighting Club. Hey, Mon Lee for Mewtwo. This is a cursed ass fucking computer. This is like a computer made by someone who's never seen computers. Empty. Alright, well the game made it pretty clear that I'm supposed to go to the fucking rock club. But I'm gonna check the challenge hall first. Alright, so I gotta do something about GR before I can even start playing the game. This is kinda weird. Sakura. Graveler, okay. Challenge Hall. Or what's this place called? Wigglytuff. What was it for Wigglytuff? Graveler. Graveler for Weekly Tough. I'll come back for you. Challenge Cup. GR disappear. Guess I'll wait it out. Alright. I haven't talked to any of the receptionists. Looks like it's like a trading section. Yeah. Alright, I didn't know that's how that worked. Okay. I guess I'll go to Ishihara's house, see what's up. Hey, asshole. Alright. I'm done fucking around. Let's go to the Rock Club. Tell me your secrets, woman. E. Makuni. Strange little man. So that probably spawned E. Makuni. In the last game, every time you talk to an NPC who mentioned Imakuni, Imakuni would appear in one of the um, areas and you could fight him. Snor, snor, snorlax! Alright. Rock Club. Snorlax. For Jigglypuff. If I had one, I'd do it. I'm so embarrassed. Alright, let's save the day with our fucking deck. The Rock Club Master. I love games like this where... It's like, it's like Battle Network. It's like Mega Man Battle Network. It's where, for whatever reason, fights are hashed out with this fucking minigame instead of like... You know, the characters punching each other. At least in the Pokemon universe, Pokemon are theoretically stronger than humans. Cool guy. Yeah, Yu-Gi-Oh does that too. People of Dr. Mason. Like a hardened stone. It's acting like I was the one from the first game, which I would be if I picked the boy, but I picked the girl. We're just retroactively pretending the main character of um, the first game was the girl, if I picked the girl. Ryan, a sculptor. He was uh, sculpting in the last game, too. Alright, let's duel. Oh, he cute. Looks like a fucking second grader. Meanwhile, I look like a fucking Yu-Gi-Oh character. Ponyta, Meowth. I'll play Meowth to be different. I only have one fucking... I drew Charmander immediately! Let's play Bill. I got Charmeleon! 
This looks nice. All right, let's get lots of heads coming up. Oh, I got sand attacked. And it did a lot of damage, too. Oh, he's ground! I'm weak to ground. Fuck. All right, new plan. Buff up this Charmander as fast as possible. Okay, I died. Uh, I can kill that. But it's a bit committal. It is committal to kill it. I should have built up the Ponyta first. I have to... Uh, I have to Ember to kill it. Oh, it's his only Pokemon. GG. Fucking fast ass battle. The tears on his face. Do you only get one booster pack in this game? In the last game, you got two booster packs every time you won. Wigglytuff, one of the best cards. What the fuck is that? Bite and Skull Bash. It's a very simple card. That Cubone is cute. It's doing the fucking um, peek from behind the wall. 30 damage. If Tails choose one of your opponent's bench Pokemon, to do 10 damage. That's quite good. You get something decent either way. And it's only one energy. And also, um, 30 damage is quite a lot for a turn 1 attack. Scratch and sh scatter spores. Oh, this is like Call for Family. What's funny is you can use this to draw other versions of Paris. In the last game, you almost always got energies of whatever club you were in. Spiro. That's actually really good versus a rock club. Flying actually beats rock in fucking um, the card game. It's a Kangaskhan. That is not a good Pokemon to be faced against. Alright, let's do this. Let's peck it. He played a Mysterious Fossil. I drew him a Chop. That's super good. It's actually really good against the Kangaskhan. I should not have put an energy on that Machop. Um... Oh, I'll go for a Machoke this game, I think. Meowth. I guess I'll play it. I would have killed this thing one turn sooner. The fuck did he just play? Kabuto I recognize. Wah! One, two, strike, 30 plus. Poof! That's funny. Just, it just get a shitload of energies really fast at the cost of all your good cards. That's pretty scary, though, the 1-2 strike. I still have a... This This does resist fighting, right? Yeah, it does. Alright, well, I'm not in too much danger. Resist means you take 30 less damage. Switch is good. I guess I just slowly wail away at him. Harden isn't a random chance. What's my retreat cost? Please be zero. It is zero! Spiro is actually a decent card! This is actually pretty nice. This is like a really good early game card. Alright. Um, let's get this swole ass fucking Machoke doing some work. Yeah, fuck him up. Mm. I think I want to force the ride on out. This thing is scary. I'd like to get some damage on it. Okay, well, he didn't kill me. I think I'm going to kill me. With this, uh, submission. R.I.P. all these cards.
Energy retrieval is super good. My spear is back. I guess I'll play a card. Can't really do anything. As long as he's hardening over and over. Growlithe is good. That's something I can actually put some cards on. I don't have any Arcanines, so I don't know if it's that useful, though. Was it again? Ah, uh, yeah. Well, that gives me something to do with all my fucking fire energies, which are doing nothing right now. Oh, wait. How good is Harden? Also, I just died. Now I feel kind of dumb. Charmeleon is coming. I do not need this Machoke. Fuck Machoke. Give me those fire energies. Alright, what's this guy do? Prehistoric Dream. All damage done by Pokemon that have evolved from Mysterious Fossil will do 10 extra damage. Okay. This does 30. This still does 0, right? Or is it water? <laughs> it's a water card! Alright. Um, my best play right now is just going to Charmander and killing this. Rock throw. This looks a little weird, but I'm going to scratch. And now it's time to evolve. Okay, this should be GG. Get fucked, nerd. No regrets. Or canine. I have Growlithe, so that's good. I do not like that that's the only move. How much HP? 80? 70! Uh. I hate this. Dracoon is fun. Professor Oak is a good card. Energy search is kind of the same as just having an energy. If you've got a deck with multiple energies, it gives you the option to get either one, which is kind of nice. Yeah, your style is stupid. Oyasuminasai! Too many words. Matthew. Didn't we just fight a Matthew? Hi. Me and Musical just played a nice chess game. It was nice for me. Spiro is king in this gym. Meanwhile, me out this garbage. Oh shit, it's a ponyta. Okay, that's like the thing I didn't want to see. It's getting worse and worse. Alright, go Meowth. Alright, play the Switch. Got a lot of fighting energies. Alright, please have, like... Oh, I got another Spiro. Good luck. He leered at me. This is funny, because I can actually go to the other Spiro and do damage to him. I can freely swap between the Spiros. Leer prevents you from doing damage. Or er, prevents you from attacking. Doesn't bother me. Chop is good. I guess I'll put a Fighting Energy on it. Go back to the other Spiro. And we attack. Dude, Spiro is OP as fuck. Alright, this time I don't have to change. Got our Charmeleon, which is presently our win con. Oh no. If I switch again, will it let me do 20? Oh, we're, we're breaking it. We're breaking the system. Having two Spiros is OP. Uh-oh. This makes me a little nervous. But I got the Charmeleon. I'm just going to kill this thing. Fuck it. I got a Diglett. I forgot I even had that. Alright. I could just kill them a chop. So I will. I mean that Geodude. 
And I guess I'll just slash this. And if he doesn't do anything, yeah, I just kill it, and that should be GG. All right. Dude, this Spiro is like the new MVP. Our K9 again. God damn it, you only get one rare per, per pack. And now they only give out one pack per victory. I got a Weedle. I have Weedle and Kakuna. I need a lot of grass energies though. None of these cards are that good. Hunter's novel at least. Alright, so can I fight you? I already fucking killed all your guys. It's Brock. It's just, it's just Brock. It's like Brock and Professor Oak got rolled into one guy. It's Brock's face on Oak's head. I kind of like this theme. Broke. Good one. Uh, this is a really good starting hand. I don't know whether I should lead with the Machop or the Ponyta. The Ponyta sets up a little slower. So I guess I'll lead with the Machop. Go, go, go. So the gym leaders always start with two energies and two Pokemon. Which is kind of bullshit, but whatever. Got my Bill, my William. I drew two Charmanders, which seems kind of good. I will play my Fighting Energy to get my low kicks off. Rhyhorn is a pretty good stalling Pokemon in the early game. In the early, you know, early match. Horn attack. Alright, well this is already pretty dire. But I've set up my Ponyta, so that's good. He's All he's done is set up one Pokemon. So, you know. Hopefully he just goes into something with no... What the fuck? He's got Stone Barrage! It's a Graveler! Flip a coin until you get Tails. This is like the same as the Geodude from the last game. This has an infinite damage potential, technically. Well, that's bad. Uh, I can kill it with Charmander after Flame Tailing it this turn. And he got Tails, so that was really fucking lucky. Should I set up multiple Charmanders, or should I just wait for one Charmeleon? Machoke. I would have liked to have that earlier. Rage. Baby Rage. Can I get a Baby Rage? I think I want to preserve this guy. Well, I would if I had something to kill this fucking... I could go into the Spiro. I'll go into the Spiro. It snivelled. Wait, can I even hurt it if it snivels? I gotta look at snivel. Okay, so I can just switch. This is the defending Pokemon, so I can just change Pokemon. So, we got the fucking hack off again. I guess I've already got the Charmander all set up. Dude, this fucking Spiro is doing so much work. Alright, Ponyta again. And then we step on it. Get stepped on, idiot. I seem to be doing well in this boss fight. I'd look at how many cards he's got in his fucking back pocket. Maybe that was the last one. Nope, he's got Onyx. Classic. How does it have two energies? Oh, that's a good move. I guess I'll go into the Spearow, because I resist his attack. What you got? Bind and Rock Tomb. He can't hurt me. Set up the other Charmander, maybe. I'll leave myself some energies, just in case. Red Tata is very, very fast to set up. And it's very decent. It's already done setting up. I'm dead serious. Okay, he successfully binded me. I have to wait. I'm not going to play any energies. Binded me again. Still not going to play any energies. I got a potion. I can play an energy. I can play a fire on the other Charmander. I'm waiting for a fucking Charmeleon. There's my chop. Um, I can just swap into something else. But nothing can kill it. 
Alright, we set up the Machop and we fucking win with the Machoke. I do not like this Pokemon that just came out. What happened? He did Whale? Oh, he did Bone Attack. Yep, I can't attack. But he didn't hurt me. So we just keep on setting up the Machoke. I could switch and then get a hit off on this guy with like the Eradicate or something, and then he'll promptly annihilate me. Let's not do that. Alright, let's, let's go into the Rattata. Yellow into the Rattata. Yeah, because that way it lets me attack this turn. Wait, Rattata also has a retreat cost of zero? I didn't know that. I should know that one. No, you can you can kill me. Oh, he actually can't kill me. So I guess I'll just keep this Rattata alive, because, you know, I can. Um... Alright, one, one prize left. And he looks like he has nothing. But I don't see a way I can win. Okay. Does this just win on the spot? Submission does 60, he has 70. He binded me. Go into the Onyx. You got no energies, motherfucker. Wait, he drew one. Dude, I'm in fucking hell right now. Oh my god, okay. This is gonna do fuck all! I've taken three damage! Ugh, I hate this. I should have kept the fucking Gust of Wind. I submitted. Alright, please... Wait, how much HP did he have? I'm gonna save state. Was it three? It's four. I think I still win though, right? Yeah. Get scratched, idiot. GG easy. That was a that was surprisingly close at the end. Unfortunately, I don't have great win cons yet. I've got no like tier two Pokemon, and I didn't draw any Charmeleons. Whoa, I got a new deck. The Fighting Coin. My guy gave me a whole deck. That's 60 cards. Currently using the Chansey Coin. Oh, it's just an alternate coin I can use. I thought it was like a badge or something. It's a coin. I can flip a fucking Kabuto instead of a Chansey. Sick. Your luck may change. It's going to give me good flips? <laughs> There's so many coins. Alright, yeah, sure. I'll swap my coin. There's... Oh my... This fucking... There's, uh, 12 coins? No, hold on. 8 times 3 is 24. 24 coins. Sure, I'll use the Kabuto. Alright, what's going on with the new deck? Okay, we got Caterpie and Metapod. That's nice, I like those too. Nidoran, Nidorino, I don't like those at all. Tangela, interesting. It's a grass and fighting deck. Diglets, don't like it. Judy Graveler, I hate those. Onyx, Cubone, Marowak, Rhyhorn. Not very fun. I think I'm just going to kill this whole deck. Oh. That's pretty cool. Whoa, there's a lot of spaces. Fuck it, yeah. Alright, now let's just, um... Alright, let's, let's modify this deck. This will now be a grass deck. I don't really have enough fucking um, grass Pokemon to warrant a whole grass deck. It could be grass fighting deck, just like it already was.
I think I have to do a two two energy deck. I just don't have enough energies. Don't like the Meowth. The trainers I can probably modify. Energy search is okay. Professor Oak is quite good. Gust of Wind is super good. Switch is decent. What the fuck is Pokedex? I don't like that. It's kind of good. I guess I'll have another Raticate. No. If anything, I should kill the Rattata and go for some fire cards. Four Ponitas? That's kind of goofy. Let's kill some of my grass cards. The Weedle and the Kakuna are going to do nothing. I hate the fucking Nidorans. Nidoran line is just annoying to use. This is that Tangela. Um, this is quite a good card. It's 100% chance to poison, I think, with Poison Powder. Yeah. And Poison is really OP. This seems fine. Fire and Grass. Kino combo. If only there were a Fire Grass type Pokemon. People like to complain about how that doesn't exist. I gotta check the challenge hall every time to make sure that they don't have a surprise challenge fucking on me. They did that in the last game. Also, I should periodically save. What's the Pokemon Dome like? Okay, the layout's a little bit different. Well, the door's just open. I can just go in. Let's go say hi to the Elite Four members. Oh. Simply wasted on likes of you fools. I can't fight him now. Those are off limits. I guess I'll go to the airport. That's a new location. Brawler. Oh! I have a GR coin, maybe. No, I don't. I have a coin. Vilici. I was expecting Gen 2 cards and Dark cards. One through four. Okay, well, that sounds pretty doable. I guess I just go visit various clubs. I'll see if Ishihara has something new to say. I guess I'll go and see if Dr. Mason has anything to say. Alright, so they're just in the clubs. I understand now. The fighting club was empty. Wait, no. This guy's here. Proof of your victory. I challenge you to a duel. This is a lot more story focused than the first game. The first game kind of turned you loose. This guy's cool looking. Okay. I drew a Weedle, Tangela, and Caterpie, and only Fire Energies. Um, I think all of these cards require me to have Grass Energies. So now I'm feeling kind of dumb. Let's go into the Caterpie. The Weedle was better. Because I have more Metapods. Spiro, um, is a card I can actually use. Look at the Poliwag! Look at it! Look at it! Bubble. That's a Poliwag. Um, it is super tempting to play that. I can I can part with one Fire Energy. Another Tangela. He's like setting up cards that aren't the Pokemon that's right here. What the fuck is he doing? He's got some bullshit going on in the back there. I gotta figure out what he's doing, because that seems scary. What's doing that? The Magnemite? Pokemon Power Magnet. 
The Fed Switch here. Wow, he can just draw infinite Magnemites with this thing. It's pretty funny. Eat the Poliwag. Oh, he went in into the Magnemite. He's beating up my Caterpie. I don't like that. But he can't... I don't know. What's the danger? I can always recover it. In fact, I'll do that right now. I could actually just let it die. He's got the potions, dude. My man's has the fucking potions. Setting up Tangela seems good. That I'm weak to electric! I forgot. Oh, it's fine, though. I got the counter. Stun Spore. And it failed. Set up the Tangela. Failed again. Professor Oak. Spear is good. Wait, I'm full? Alright, well, I'll wait for this to die. Alright. Um. God. Tangela, it's. It's it's either one, right? It wasn't either one. Oh, but bind this 20. Polywag is weak to grass, I think. Yeah, most electric card or most water cards are weak to electric. But the um, the polywag line for whatever reason are weak to grass for no reason at all. Um just it's good to have different different weaknesses in your deck. I could just kill the Poliwag right now, but I'd rather kill this thing. This is the most dangerous thing on his team right now. I like how I used an energy on this for no fucking reason at all. I could fuck up the... Fucking up the Magnemite's tempting. What I could do... Eh, fuck it, I should win if I just bind. Oh, I paralyzed him. You know. I could paralyze him again if I'm lucky. I am lucky. Oh, baby. Um, this thing is wounded. I could attempt to kill the Poliwhirl while I've got the chance. I get a lot of damage on it. I did not kill it. That's a nice-looking Poliwhirl. Retrieve my energy, perhaps? Um, I don't know which one I'd rather have. I'll just take one of each. Oh, I had a Metapod. I should have taken two Grass. Caterpie's wounded, though. Metapod's a good card, though. Okay, I kind of forgot that this thing was here. Brain status, don't have. Um, I can slash it and it'll die. That seems decent. Okay, can I do 40 damage in one go? No, but... I can step on it some. Okay, this is a little... This is getting ugly. I need this Metapod to do some work. Gust of Wind him into any, anything, and I can just kill it. Alright, we're good. Whew, I went a little close. Uh, I beat one. Rocket booster pack. Give me some dark cards. Give me the rocket cards. Devolution spray. Dark muck! We got one! Woo! Sticky goo and sludge punch. So the rocket cards, the fully evolved of each one is called dark blank instead of the regular name. And then there are certain cards that I think power up Pokemon with dark in the name. Trainer cards, I mean. Whoa, extra retreat cost. It's not super helpful, though. Oh, 100% chance of poison is super busted. Alright, Dark Muck is probably really good. Poison is very broken. It just lasts forever. It lasts until you switch out, and this thing raises the retreat cost. 60 HP is not super high. Magmar is kind of good. Dark Machoke. Scary. Look at it. Look how scary it is. It's probably better than Machoke Machoke. I can put it in my deck if I wanted to. Whoa. It does 20 damage to something else. And also, being able to force the opponent to switch Pokemon is actually pretty busted. 
And this one does damage before the swap. So this one swaps you. This one shuffles your opponent's team a lot, and you can choose whether you attack the new or the old Pokemon. That's pretty crazy. This one's really good. Full heal energy? We got fucking status energies now. We got rainbow energy somewhere, probably. I wonder if there's... No, there can't be metal and dark Pokemon. There must be nothing... No Gen 2 stuff. Gen 2 added uh, metal energies and dark energies, but they're super shitty. So, um, common energies, you can have an infinite number of them in your deck, but energies like these... Um, you can only have four in your deck. So, uh, and uh, metal energy and dark energy were both uh, special energies. So you could only have four of them. So it was like super hard to make like a dark deck or a metal deck. Because you could only have four of the fucking energy. It was really stupid. That's kind of good. Dark Raticate. Non Hyper Fang. Nah seems okay. Hyper Fang seems kind of shitty. Yeah, good, good in a clutch moment, I guess. But generally speaking, the damage potential is only fucking five higher than the other move. Objectively, it's pretty useful. I would say it's better than the, um, the Reticate I have. I don't know, because two energies to do something is a bit annoying. That's a different Ponyta. Ember. That's just flat worse than the other Ponyta. What the fuck is this? This is just a downgrade. It's got 10 extra HP, I guess. Right? The other Ponyta's 40, I think. But the other Ponyta does two fucking... Um, it's better on a, a, a non-fire deck. And it uh, does 30 damage without having to throw something away. This is only better in the instance that you have exactly one fire energy. You Squirtle. See, cards like this with no energy, specific energy cost, you can just throw into any deck. This doesn't have to be in a water deck. I can put it in my deck right now. Keep Rattata. Trickery and Quick Attack. Do I get to see them? Or do I just swap them? Oh, the Charmander's cute. Gather fire. <laughs> you can steal energies from my other Pokemon. That's... Mm, I don't know if that's good. I guess it's good. I'll throw one into my deck just to see how it feels. Oh, I got two. Beedrill, good card. I now have Weedle, Kakuna, and Beedrill, but I would like several Beedrills before I throw them in. Uh, nothing but good shit in this deck, in this thing. Everything here is decent. Got coin piece number one. He sure is nice. They give me all this shit. Okay. So once I rescue all the Clubmasters, this is going to turn into the regular game. I mean, this is not that hard to understand. The rules aren't super complex. Lightning Club? What's weak to grass? Rock. I guess I can go to the Grass Club with all my fire Pokemon. Seems very logical. Oh. Chuck the fucking Supersonic and Swoop Dive. Defending Pokemon is now confused. That's good, I guess. 10 damage to itself. 40 damage and 10 damage to myself is not too bad. 70 HP is really good. What was the energy cost? 4-3. It's kind of annoying. Unfortunately, you can only get Aerodactyl by using Mysterious Fossil. You can't just play it. Cute Golbat. Leech Life probably restores 10. Nose Dive, I have no idea. It might do damage to itself. Golbat doesn't even have a nose. Oh, that's a lot. 40 damage to yourself. That's shitty. I would never use that card. This Magmar is quite a good card. I could put it in my deck, actually. I love this Slowpoke. This is one of my all-time favorite Pokemon cards. I love that it's fucking that far away. Look at him. Look at him all the way over there. It's like the cameraman couldn't get a little closer. There's something really funny about the fact that the camera's so zoomed out. 
I can't put my finger on it. It's just, I don't know, it's hard to explain. That one's quite good. Two different energies. Poison gas, confusion gas. Is that coin flip for both of them? Yep. Interesting Taros. Kicking and stamping. Interesting. Classic Squirtle. Alright, yeah, let's fight. The poison types are grass types, originally. They become uh, psychic types in later in later TCG. Poison went from being, I think... Poison did some jumping. I think it was dark for a bit, too. Or maybe it's dark now. I think it was, it was, I think it was grass, then psychic, then dark. But it might be grass, then dark, then psychic. They can't decide what they want Poison to be. Obviously, I want to play Charmander, but I have no energies at all. So I want something to just sit there and stall. Which I guess will be this Tangela. Probably the worst card to lead with. Metanet. Alright, I got a Grass Energy. I'll put that on Caterpie, I guess. I got another Grass Energy. I can put that on another Caterpie if I want. I could also put it on the Charmander so the Charmanders can scratch. Fuck it, I guess I'll do that. Another Grass Energy. I guess I could put it on the other Caterpie. Professor Oak. Eh. Okay. This seems decent. There's a fire energy. No metapod. Alright. Charmeleon's all set up. Oh, I filled my bench. I'm an idiot. I should have played only one of those. Alright, this this fucking um this little caterpie actually did it. This little caterpie that could. He got the flip. Uh I don't think Nidoran is weak to I don't think Nidoran is weak to fire. It's weak to psychic. This is a poison type. Fairy doesn't exist anymore in the TCG, huh? They made a fairy energy. They took it out? Oh, it's probably because they're doing some new Gen 1 stuff, aren't they? What's funny is dual-type Pokemon sometimes appear as one type and sometimes as another. In different uh, lines. Like, I think there have been... Um, what's a good example? Like, maybe there's been a Nidorino at some point that was fighting and another Nidorino that was, like, grass. Um, it's definitely the safe play to just kill this thing, so I guess I will. Feels kind of bad, though. Razor Leaf. Uh, Slash should just kill it. I don't need this Kakuna. Yikes. I got Poison Powdered, but it doesn't matter. I can just use Ember and I win. GG. I like how they added sad faces to everyone, but they look super shitty. Two booster packs. Well, maybe two. She said plural. Doug Trio. No new cards. I recognize all those. Snowax is kind of fun. What's this Jinx? Pound and Double Slap. That's quite good, I guess. 40 damage on turn two. Another Kakuna. Another Weedle. Weedle and Kakuna are really nice. Ishihara. That's the same as the last game, actually. Ooh. Kangaskhan. Clefairy. But not a rare Clefairy. An uncommon Clefairy. I've seen this Tentacruel. It's fossil. But I don't 
think it was in the last game. Pokemon Trader. I thought this was a rare. It's a common? I thought this was a rare. What the fuck? I'm, I'm going nuts. Alright, so... I actually want to put those guys in my deck. Let's get another Weedle and another Kakuna. Do I have more Grass Energies? No. Taking energies out feels a little bit ugly, but I think it's a better deck. No, I should have taken out something else. No, I like the Spiros. Energy Retrieval is kind of nice. I think I want to keep that. I might not need both potions. I don't need three switches. Oh, but Bill is nice. Alright, fuck it. We're good like this. Alright. Mind you. Please take this. I got another deck. That's nice. They're giving me 60 cards every time I do that. Yo, this Oddish. Kino coin. Hundred percent, isn't that oddish? Kino fucking oddish, dude. Right, what's going on in this deck? Oh, we got more grass. This is good. This is good. This is a lot more grass energies. I probably have enough to make a full grass deck now. Oh, we got yes, yes, yes. We got um, we link Kakuna. Paris and Parasect. Very interesting. All right, show me the grass energies. Fifteen. Best dual type combination. The best in terms of just raw, like, weaknesses and resistances, I think, is Steel Fairy, followed by Electric Fairy. I mean, Electric Steel. If you just look at the sheer amount of, you know. But, like, the best theoretical type isn't necessarily the one with the most, like, resistances. It's, like, you know, the most useful pairing of, like, stabs or something like that. Like, Electric, electric Steel is, is really good on paper for the number of resistances it gives, but the dual weakness to ground is super shitty. Alright, this deck is going kaput. And we are fully un, unfiring this deck. It will now be a Grass deck. As your removal is really busted. Gust of Wind is good. Oh wait, I already have that one. Plus Power is good. Another William. I guess I could check some fucking... Um... Bulbasaur's in. I could also check in Parasect. Paris and Parasect. Spore 100%? Yep. Yeah, it's not that good. I actually still have room. I can just put in extra energies if I want. I could put in two Tangles. I have 22 grass energies, that's probably fine. Alright, this deck looking kind of nice. So I didn't actually have to beat up, um... Oh yeah. This is just going to be nothing, right? Until I... Yeah, until I do something about the Team GR. This is super cool. Because there's still, like... Oh, is there? It shows only the event coins. Will I not be fighting all the team leaders? I'm sure they're all fightable. What the fuck is this? I thought he would just be in there. What? I'm 
Where is he? Oh, you're gonna block me, huh? Go to the lightning club. I wanna explore this place yet. Does the science club also block me? No. Tell me the words. Yes, I will duel you. There are a lot of people who seem to have not had their cards stolen. I, I think I can win on the spot with this glorious Caterpie. Yep, this Caterpie's going to do some work, I feel it. Oh, yep, yep, yep. This is a game-winning Caterpie right here. I need your removal. I can play that if I want. I won't, but I could. Oh, this Caterpie is killing it. G fucking G. He's the same Bulbasaur. Yeah. I guess I'll set it up. We've got William. Kakuna. If I could draw a Weedle, I'm gonna win. Weedle like instantly wins. I have like all the fucking setup I need. He's doing call for family and that's pissing me off. Stop. Stop. Oh my god, give me a fucking Weedle. Yeah. I got worst possible luck. That was shitty. I want to keep three energies for the fucking beetle that I eventually draw. Ah, dude, this guy's fucking flips. Alright, paralyzed him. There's the Weedle. GG. I've already won. It doesn't look like I've won, but I've won. I'm not even going to get to play the fucking Weedle. No, I will do anything to play the Weedle. Kill me. Alright, I don't give a shit. I'm fucking going to the Weedle. I gotta do the Beedrill. Oh, I forgot Beedrill has a retreat cost of zero. Fuck yeah, look at that. Poison Sting. I could have just killed it, but instead I switched into a Pokemon that also just killed it. Should be the poison animation. Yeah! I just want poison to be super effective to one additional thing. Poison is too shitty of an attacking type. That's what makes Fairy so strong. If you had more poison Pokemon throwing around poison moves would be better. Beedrill? That's super nice. I can throw that straight into my deck. Anything else? Ivysaur is... it's fine. Charizard. Haha, <laughs> that's nice. That's a nice one. I've got the whole line. Uh, another Kakuna. This looks good. I can ditch up Bulbasaur in favor of the glorious Beedrill. I'll take out a Tangela in favor of another Kakuna. I have enough. Never mind. Rock weak to poison would make rock even worse. Alright, is this number two? Am I in the right spot? Hey, 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 what a sight. He offers to duel me. I can say no. He's the normal type fucking guy. It's funny looking. Oh, I can't draw anything. Alright, it still gives you infinite redraws. I appreciate that. I think in the official rules, you can only redraw your deck twice, and if you draw no basics and two full things, you just lose. Caterpie and Weedle. And no energies. Oh, fuck. That's not good. I need to draw a fucking energy now. Alright, I will use my energy removal, and I will promptly use my fucking Professor Oak. There we go, that's more like it. He's weak. He's weak to grass. Fuck yeah. Evolve. Evolving cancels, um, status. God, I've gotten status every attempt. Um, build up a Weedle. Alright, there we go. I guess I'll heal. Seems these. Weedle only needs three energy cards to be fully set up. I guess I'll set up another Caterpie. I'd rather set up another Weedle. 
plus power, sure. Got the Kakuna. Yeah, do your worst. I have the fucking... Fucking Kakuna. Did they add an HP to it? I don't remember it having this much HP. I thought I had 70 or 60. Is this just me? Am I going nuts? Tangela. I don't really want to set that up. I'll get the other Kakuna going. Potion. Sure. This should be pretty easy. He's got a lot of fighting types that are weak to... Uh... Dude, look at this Diglett. Holy shit. He's coming out of there. He's popping out. Coming from the underground. Dig under and scratch. 10 damage to any Pokemon on the opponent's side. That's novel. Occasionally useful. Scratch, 20 damage is decent. Please have... Okay, 40 HP. I think base Diglett had 30 HP and it was like the least of any Pokemon. Which is funny because Diglett actually has low ass HP in the fucking games. It was unmistakably a better idea to... Um, Set up the Metapod. Wow, good luck. I mouse slipped into a mate. Like, you getting mated? I mouse slipped recently. It fucking hurt. I lost a knight for a pawn, because I mouse slipped. And I lost the game. That's a mood. Dark Machamp. I can put this into my deck. I'd have to put the whole fucking Machop line in, though. Mega Punch for 30 and Fling. Into the deck! Jesus. That's pretty neat. That's a cool card. If they send in something that's all set up against you, you fling it. And if they set in something that's weak and not set up, you just fucking beat it up with your 30 damage attack. A uh, different Charmeleon than the Charmeleon I currently have. Holy hell. Use this attack only if there are any fire energy targets attached to Dark Chameleon. Why does it say that? It costs three to use. There must be a trick there. Flip a coin. If heads, discard one of those energy cards. If tails, this attack does nothing. So you don't discard at least. Maybe you get the tails. I'd rather just use regular Ars Charmeleon. This Prime Ape! It's kind of creepy. 40 damage for two energies is pretty good. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> no, no, no. This card looks extremely cursed. What's the damage to yourself for confusion? I don't remember what it is. I don't remember if it's a fixed number, but you just do the damage of your attack to yourself. You might do 20 to yourself. I don't remember. So if it's 20 to yourself, then it does 50 to itself if it's confused. But its frenzied attack goes from 40 power to the first use to 70 power on subsequent uses. Pretty novel. Dark Radicate. I already looked at that one. That Eevee is different. Eevee is not a very good card at all. But it's very versatile. Because it can evolve into, you know, the other evolutions. And I think all the evolutions work with only normal energies for at least one of their attacks. I think they all have, like, quick attack. And that way you can just chuck them into any deck, which is kind of nice. Obviously they're better in a deck that's the same color as them, so you can actually use their other attack. This one is, um... these. I got a Grimer. That goes with my Dark Mock. Whoo! That's good! That doesn't look good, but it's good. I really want to put the Grimer and the Muck into my deck. I wish I had more Grimers. This Rocket Grimer looks really fun. That's a really good card. 40 HP. Dark Rapidash. This is a common. Ugh, I don't like it that much. Alright, well, I like the Grimers. Whoa! Electabuzz! One of the all-time best cards of fucking early, early TCG. This guy's a killer. Super good. Farfetch'd is quite good, too. 
energy removal is quite nice, I suppose. I'm out of here. I am ready for a random boss fight with Ronald. I get a feeling. It's been too long. I haven't done one. Let's put the Grimer in my deck now. Let's get rid of the Tangelas and just grab fucking Grimer and Muck. Fuck it. I really should have a computer search if I'm going to have Muck. It's whatever. It is Ronald, dude. I fucking knew it. I called it. I called it so hard. Ronald does this to you after the first two boss fights of um, the first game. I've got a full deck now. Yep, he forces you, and then he's got a card that you only get if you beat him. And you get one chance. That's how it works in the first game. It's undoubtedly going to work the same here. But I drew two Weedles, and I have lots of energies. And I drew a Caterpie. This is probably already GG. I've already won. Sing. Very interesting. I guess I'll play Bill. Why not, right? Another Caterpie. Let's get the poison, okay? Oh my god. How about we get the poison? Oh, I got it. Alright, GG. Hide in shell. I'll hold off on that. Okay, so I'm like wounding every one of his Pokemon. Which is kind of nice. He successfully hit in shell. Does that prevent status? Other effective attacks still happen. Sorry, I'm, I'm too good. I know all the rules of Pokemon. I poisoned it. I do not like the presence of that fucking Cloyster. Uh, I'll play a Switch. Wait. Yeah, I can I can play a Switch and then go into my Metapod and kill this because it dies to poison. Wait! Poison went away. Right, I'm playing with fire if I do that. But I think I'll do it. I got a 50-50 chance of paralyzing it anyway. Damn it. Oh, that just failed. This just fails? It tails this attack does nothing. Metapod? Strat? Negates the weakness of grass? I don't know what you're talking about. You're talking about Stiffen? I didn't know that there was a fucking Metapod Strat. I just got a Metapod, okay? That's the extent that I know about Metapod. Alright, all of his Pokemon are wounded as hell. And not paralyze it. Beedrill. Alright, now I just need to draw the fucking Kakuna, which I've got four of. How many energies does the fucking Grimer need? Two. The grammar seems good. I'll set it up. No, I won't. I'll wait. No, I've got two energies. I'll set it up. I got two potions. Plus power is good. Boy, I sure would love a fucking. Um... Oh, I should poison this. Poisoning this would help a lot. I don't have a switch. I don't want to spend the energy. Oh, I wish I had a Butterfree in my deck. Right, that Weedle's all set up, maybe. Come on, fucking... I don't want him to scrunch. Oh, I drew my switch. Alright, Grammar, do your thing. <gasps> I died. Alright, back to Metapod. So much for that. Damn it. He gust of winded my fucking Weedle that was all set up. I didn't know the, the enemies would have that. I'm crying. I just do the Kakuna. No. Alright. Gonna put all my hopes and dreams into this fucking guy. It's fine. I had a backup Weedle. I suppose he didn't submission me. What do I not need? I don't need this Caterpie. Stop scrunching. No, the Beedrill's all set up. This 
guy's got good ass cards. I just saw him play a fucking Hitmonchan. Dark Muck, there it is, just mocking me, but I don't have a Grimer anymore. It's my hubris. How many do you need? Three? Alright, fuck it. Set you up next. I should have played, um, 100% I should have played a plus power there. It's whatever, though. Special punch. Here, objectively, plus power is good. Um, I can just kill that. Let's go to Beedrill. Beedrill is actually surprisingly less committal. Since it has a retreat cost of zero. And now I just kill the Chansey and I win. Wow. That's super good. If that Pokemon is in this game, I will um, put one in my deck. He had like actual meta. Ooh, super energy retrieval. He had actual meta mons. Perpetually checking on Challenge Hall. Um, I guess I'll say hi to Ishitara. Every time I do something, I have to be Clefairy level 15. I think I do. I actually had that one. Cool. Flying Pikachu, everyone's favorite. Yo, I like this game more than I like the first game. This is crazy. All the new cards are super neat. I love the first game a lot, too, so this is, like, really fucking neat. Yeah, fire is a little... I don't know. Every single fucking flamethrower mon. Um, I've been to science. I guess I'll try psychic and like get some more information about what's going on over there. Unfortunately, my grass deck is going to be useless versus fire. I might be able to do some work at the water club. So this is just done, right? Oh, these guys are back in here. Can I fight the guy now? Where is he? Oh, he's still kidnapped. That's right. Uh, I'm just going to fight this guy. What we got? Disable. This Bulbasaur can actually attack with only one energy, which is one of the biggest downsides of the original Bulbasaur. Psybeam is super awful, and I'm just going to lose, I think. I need to draw, like, a fucking, um... Do I have plus power? Damn it. I need to draw, like, a Mon, like, now. Alright, well, I just lose if I don't... If I get confused here. I don't have Ivysaur, right? Yeah. Alright, well, GG. Ah, I hit myself. Nice short battle. That can happen in any given Pokemon match. You can just, like, get really unlucky. Alright, this time I got Weedle. Weedle's good. Horn Hazard first turn? Ugh! You hate to see it. Alright, use my bills. He's still poisoned, it's fine. Ah, oh, he got it again. Motherfucker. Alright, this is actually good. He's gonna die on his turn. Or, I mean, on my new turn. Okay, he swapped. Um, is it really worth it? I think it's fine. Just get one attack off. Or is it? Alright. All I've got to do is draw a Kakuna. And also a bunch of energies. Fuck this Metapod. That's not what I needed. Oh, I got the Kakuna, though. There's hope. There's hope in this messed up world. Oh, he has no energies on anything. We're probably fine. No, you don't like to see that. Play the Bulbasaur, play the Beedrill. Go for the Poison Sting. Got it. He's dead. And now Poison Sting just kills and I win. Alright. GG. 
Should I turn the volume off? Just because I'm speeding it up so much. I usually like muting my game when I'm using speed up a lot. Is that I never like this Aptos. It's the one that makes you discard everything, isn't it? No, this is the other Aptos. No, yeah, this is the one that you discard everything. I mean, 100 damage, you almost never need that much at once. Like, what are you trying to kill? Fucking Chansey? Snorlax? I'd rather use Thunder, but the downside is super annoying. There are a lot of, all the legendaries are like basics. Um, the, the cost is too high. I'm quite fond of this Tangela. I think it's decent. My chop is good. Diglett can be good. Diglett can have uh, really funny games, just because it gets turn two like up to sixty damage if you got if they're weak to you. But the HP is so low. Hypno, Midorino. Nothing super interesting. I might be able to throw together a water deck. I don't want to go to the fire region until I've got a water deck going. Water decks are really OP, basically in the whole TCG, I think, because Rain Dance is so crazy. Polyrath and Blastoise decks, I used a lot in the first game. Polyrath is really fucking busted, and Blastoise is really, really fucking busted. Let's try the Psychic Club. So tell me your fucking thing. So this is number four. Lightning Club for number three, apparently, maybe. What the fuck is this guy's problem? You see that shit? Your hat looks lovely. I'd like to be your friend. This guy's hitting on me. I'm getting hit on. Alakazam. I don't think I have that one. Alakazam for something. Psychic Club. Okay. The lyrics to my name is Imakuni. I don't like Zapdos. I didn't like Electric in early TCG. Electric's not a very good deck, I think. Like, let me look at them all real fast. Where's my cards? How do I just look at my cards? There's no, like, cards button. I guess I gotta do it like this. Um, grass is good. Fire is good, but you burn through a lot of cards. Water is super crazy. Electric, I think, is weak. Fighting, I think, is good. Psychic, I think, is good, but a little setup heavy. Normal can just squeeze into any other deck. I think I think um, Electric's probably the weakest one in early TCG. Every Electric Mon has really low HP, which is annoying. Uh, Polyrath and Blastoise. Voltorb level 10. Do I have it? Nope. Electric Club. Young Punk. Mudada. Brandon. Jennifer. She had the all Pikachu deck last game. Yeah, yeah. There, it's well, it's you use it with Pokemon with uh, Pokemon breeders. The thing is, once you have a Blastoise on the deck at all or on the field at all, which can be as early as turn two, then you can play as many uh, water cards as you want. So literally, turn one, you can draw a Squirtle. Once you have Squirtle, Blastoise, and Pokemon Breeder, then on turn two, you can have a Blastoise, and then you just overload the rest of your deck with um. Water, water energies. And then you just play like four energies in one turn and just fucking nuke everything with your Blastoise. And then Polyrath is really good too because um, uh, it prevents the opponent from setting up. It's super good, trust me. having an opponent set against me. 
Alright, so I gotta fight them one by one. Nicholas looks like fucking a backyard baseball kid. Somehow. Carpy. I got the Grimer. Round one Grimer actually seems pretty decent. I'm gonna keep the last Carpy in my hand. And he put me to sleep turn one. This Voltorb, dude! Fucking, I could literally draw a better Voltorb than this. This is one of those ones that it's, it's fan mail. I think. There were a lot of Pokemon cards that were literally just like, like, just kids drew the Pokemon. People submitted, submitted art for the, for the cards. This is the best Voltorb ever. I sure am asleep. Do I even put an energy on myself? I guess I do. Okay, I'm awake. We're good. We're good. We're good. Set up the Bulbasaur. Poison gas. Oh, he had a full heal. Motherfucker. He can't have a bunch of them, though. Surely. He had two full heals! Of all the bullshit. I got leak slapped. That was bad luck. That's fine. I could use the Professor Oak. It's tempting. I'll play the energy, then use the Professor Oak. Do I want a gust of wind him into something? No. I can part with that gust of wind. Alright, here we go. We got a Weedle. And a Bill. Fuck yeah. Okay. Everything looking kind of good right now. Super good looking game. Uh, I could use the plus power and then kill him with the attack that heals me. Perhaps it's a bit greedy, but... Yeah, I should have saved that, honestly. He's just dead. I won. Alright, GG. I want that fucking Voltorb. He didn't give me a fucking pack! Are you kidding me? I didn't even know that they could do that. So this is the Lightning Cut uh, Gym Leader. Surprised I'm fighting him this early. Got the Dark Muck right away. And a Professor Oak, which is super bad because I want to hold on to the Dark Muck. We got the fucking in-game counter pick. Well, the in-universe counter pick. Spiro eats Weedles. Did not get the poison, it would have been nice. Oh, I had Beedrill. Okay, he was forced to switch. If I can poison this, I'm in I'm in I'm in deep. I'm in his head. Oh baby. GG. It doesn't matter you're poisoned. I've already won. I really want a fucking I wanna draw a Kakuna. I don't want to set up this Weedle, though, because I have a feeling it could just die. I mean, what's he going to do? There's no point in setting up anything I've got left. How many Beedrills do I have in my deck? I don't remember. Whatever. He has Fero? Oh my goodness. Fero. I'm going to do something potentially very greedy. If I can get a Kakuna, and then if I draw a fucking... Damn it. <laughs> well, I was going to say Kakuna, and then I get the coin flip for the poison. That would have killed him. Oh well. This is still good. Okay, I still kill him. Ah, the Beedrill! Mother f I didn't need Beedrill, I just need Kakuna. Well, There's a Kakuna. I unfortunately don't have a Weedle. Or do I? Alright, setting up the Weedle is the next priority. Do I have a Bulbasaur? I do not. He has no energies. Alright, that's actually super good. Guess the Windham to his Pikachu? I don't see the point.
Alright, all set up. Oh my god. What do I not need? I need all these. I guess I don't need the Weedle. I have nothing to fucking even put energies on yet. Grimer! No, I fucking put the muck away. I'll never get that evolution off as long as I only have one of each. Sakura, you read it. Good reading. Good hiragana. And your removal is tempting. Oh, I want the Spiro. Oh, we had another one. Fuck, I put that Weedle away, but now I've got like almost the stuff needed to set it up again. Ivysaur. There's another Weedle. Might as well set it up. Uh, Beedrill probably just wins. I get that feeling based on the way things are kind of playing out. What is that? Oh, he forced me to switch. Motherfucker. I've got a switch in my hand, though. Get poison, nerd. Full heal. I have no plus powers. This poison wins. Yeah, I got the poison. Even if I didn't get poison, I was going to kill him next turn, probably. I did my best. Alright, give me the coin. I know you have a coin. <laughs> he just gives it back. A lightning coin. So these seem to just be replacing the metals, as it turns out. The grass coin seems a little bit more themed to me. The Oddish coin. I like Oddish too, so... I definitely should have saved before stepping out. There could have been a Ronald fight. I don't think there's going to be any sort of issue if I go to Challenge Hall and just check. Or Ishihara and just check. Okay, I got Ishihara's trade. That's right. I freaked out. I was like, oh no, was this trade temporary? That guy is literally just the red sprite from Pokemon Red and Blue in the middle there. They just reused that. That's shameless. No, fucking Murray was the the troll boss of the last game. I'll um check the people in here. No, I already talked to them because that was the guy who wanted the Alakazam. Stephanie, this sprite is so fucking cool. I don't know how to explain it. I love her. I want to marry this character. Proto Hex Maniac right here. All right. Weedle and Kakuna, and Weedle. This is a super strong start, and she has only one card, and it's a fucking very, very cool looking Ghastly. Frighten and Darkness. Okay, no trainer cards, and Confusion 50% of the time. I win on the spot if I get the poison. I got the poison. Oh, he drew a fucking another card. What is that? It's an Abra. It's like sitting in a tree. Does damage to the bench Pokemon. That's pretty funny. Once again, I win on this. Like, if I can poison this. Oh well. Let's heal this other Weedle. I guess we'll play the Caterpie. I drew my Grimer. I love my Grimer. Uh, I can switch. I guess I can switch into my Grimer. I'm just poison this. Yeah, what about that? Couldn't do anything about it. Writing was on the wall. No fucking... No fucking... Wait, what? You don't even fight him? That's just two. This guy had a huge troll deck. Oh my god! What is going on in his deck? Alright, what do we got? Weedle and Caterpie. Weedle is a better early game mon. Actually, maybe Caterpie is, because you got the early game stalling. 
Is this a do the wave deck? I hope not. All right, let's just let's just nip this problem in the bud and poison this thing. Dude, literally turn one fucking um. I feel like I should try and kill something. I want the Mr. Mime out, maybe? I'd like to kill that. That thing's super annoying. Oh, it's not even that Mr. Mime. It's a different Mr. Mime. I should have looked before I left. Gust of Wind is usually really important in this fight, too. Well, it's dead anyway, so that's something. Another Grass Energy. Oh, I'm getting do the waved on turn, like, two! This is bad. I don't think I need all these Metapods. Oh, there's only one energy. I'm dumb. Alright, we gotta kill this thing fast. Dude, the wave is so busted. Alright, I need a clutch fucking paralys paralysis right now. Oh, I got it. I got it. That was super clutch. That was so fucking clutch. I lost if I didn't get that. Drew a Weedle. Weedle is good. Weedle is a good card. Oh, he f made me forget. Oh, motherfucker. Alright, we're both just setting up, I guess. This is bad. I think his deck sets up faster than mine. Bulbasaur is good. I can just kill this if I get Ivysaur out. And I can just switch into it. I just need three energies on it. There's the Kakuna. As soon as I draw another energy, I can just nuke this thing. But he's getting some nice... Oh, I got my Dark Muck, just to troll me. Just draw an energy. I've got a gazillion. Bill will draw me an energy. Nice, I knew it. Alright, the Ivysaur. The Switch. I'm so glad I got the... I, got, I needed the Poison and the Paralysis to kill that Wigglytuff. I got, like, insanely lucky. Juggling did quite a lot of damage. No plus powers for me. Guess I'll Leech Seed. I hate that he just drew another fucking... Wigglytuff. How much will Wigglytuff do? Let's do the wave. It's got enough energy to do it, too. Ten for each bench Pokemon. So it'll come out, and he'll have two on the bench. And then it'll do ten damage. Thirty, I guess? I'm, not, I'm gonna play it safe. I'm gonna use the potion. He might just utterly dab on me right now with um, a bunch of bench Pokemon. <laughs> Motherfucker, he actually did. I actually have nothing I can put these energies on. I guess I'll start setting up another Bulbasaur. Um, stall him with the Metapod. Keep setting up the Bulbasaur. Did not get the, um, process I needed. I think this is okay, though. I've almost won. Big Yawn puts us both to sleep. I've got Switch. Can I just energy removal him? Is that possible? Will that be enough? I don't know what his moves are. Let's we'll switch into the Ivysaur and see if we can just kill him in a couple turns. Alright, well, I woke up this time. Okay, we got the B drill. Be funny if I drew out my deck. Wait, plus power. I need like a lot. It would be really funny if I drew out my deck. Alright, I think I just won. Thank god. Praise try victory. That I should have lost. I had the one fourth chance of not just instantly getting nuked. Fuck the do the wave decks, they're so busted. Crafty deck. Psychic coin. I love how they give you whole decks. That's actually super fun. It's really lame that they give you only one deck to start. 
But the fact they give you a whole dex, like, as you keep going is actually a huge improvement. So it's a psychic deck. No Alkazam. Gave me a weird looking Electabuzz. It's kind of good, I guess. It's got, it costs way too much. It's good once it sets up. Is this just three EVs? It actually is. I don't like that EV. Energy removal? No. It's got energy retrieval. Full heal is kind of good. I like those. Two bills. Two bills is good. Alright, time to dismantle it. I'm not actually going to salvage anything from it, though. I was super risky to just leave here without fucking... I could have I could have died to a Ronald fight. Alright. Time to think. Where's the last one? I never went to the water and the fire. This game is really fucking good so far. Joshua. Alright, please have the polywag line so I can kill you easily and fast. Alright, I will take a I will take a magic arp. I should have set up the um no, they're both decent. Iron grip. Cut that out. Nice fucking heads. Bulbasaur. Nice fucking heads. Caterpie, sure. I think I'll play the energy and then the Professor Oak. I'm gonna greed. Let's give me an Ivysaur. I got one. I should hold off on evolving it. There's no reason to do it right now. Alright, now's the perfect time. No, my Dark Muck, I have to throw it away again. I got the Grimer. I just need another of that Grimer, and then I'm just sitting pretty. Alright, where's the Ivysaur? I really like this Ivysaur. This is a lot better than the Ivysaur from the base set. 40 damage is a nice value. It's, it's, it's very similar to War Turtle from base set. I think it's better, because you also have the healing. is super useful. This is like... The War Turtle's Bite, and then the Bulbasaur's Leech Seed on one Mon. This is really nice. This is a really nice Mon. Guess I'll set up the Caterpie because I have the Metapod right there. Yeah, I just win. I've been defeated. Take these booster packs. That's what I have to see. This is Zapdos I don't like. I got another Bulbasaur. Scoop up. That's uh, potentially a very good card, but I probably won't ever make a scoop up deck. They're very obnoxious, but they're really strong. It's hopeless, isn't it? She says. What she actually said was Shkataganai. Imakuni must be somewhere. I've been to almost every location. Is he just in the fire one? Ah, I found him. Pretty sure that's Imakuni. Yep. Imakuni? Card pop. Okay, he forces me to a card pop instead of fighting. And I got the Imakuni card. Your active Pokemon is now confused. Imakuni wants you to play him as a basic Pokemon, but you can't. A mysterious creature not listed in the Pokedex. Yes, kids around the world who is cuter, Pikachu or me. Datata, he said. Okay, bye. I thought we'd be fighting him. Flareon. Fire Club Flareon. Almost every club has someone who wants something to trade.
Brawler. Alright, the Water Club I can potentially beat. Did I talk to everyone here? Yeah. You were the Imakuni person? Yep. I should have taken a record of who the potential Imakuni NPCs were. So there's the guy. How do I get in there? Can't talk to them. Event coins five. That's gotta be like just like the progress meter. Take a look at the pool. Fuck yeah, let's fight. Oh, he's sad. He's electric type. I started with uh, Weedle Cocoon and Beedrill. This will be a win. I, I feel it. Oddish! A favorite. Look at it. What a great card. Alright, time to win. Okay, turn one poison is a nice look. Turn two Kakuna is also a nice look. Potentially should have sat on that. Professor Oka didn't want to draw yet. Um, five? I could kill it. If I'm lucky. What does Growl do? What happened? Oh, he. I do 10 less damage. He needs two fire energies to attack? Alright, I'm not in any danger. I can just, um... I can set up something else and set up Beedrill next turn. It evolved. It only has, um... 50 HP, though. 40 now. So I actually do kill it next turn. I would have liked to have more HP, though. That's Professor Oak. No potions. But the other, the rest of the situation is pretty good. Magmar Fire Punch. Ugh. I'm fighting a fire deck. That's bad to just lose my fucking bead drill just like that. Let's set up a Bulbasaur. Touch. Um, I can kill him with two plus powers. No, I have to do damage. I've got to try for a sticky hands. Yeah, fuck it, let's do it. Got him. William. I drew a Beedrill. I can probably start setting up another Weedle. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Oh my god, I didn't mean to put all these fucking Pokemon on my bench. It's full. I don't know what to set up. The safest thing is the Bulbasaur. The safest thing is probably the Metapod. That's a bit unfortunate. Ooh, I didn't mean to go into that. I'm dumb. Alright, can I switch him into something? No, he's got a Charmander. It's kind of scary. I drew another energy that was lucky. I need more energies, like, badly. Do I potion? What's going on with the Charmeleon? It's just a Charmander. And it's only got one Grass Energy. What's going on with the Magmar? No energies. I might be alright. I'll I'll take it. I'll take it. Take it as is. Bill. Oh, fuck. And just like that. I have the potion, but it's not enough. I got the two plus powers, that seems kind of decent. I think playing one plus power is probably fine, actually. What do I set up? The Weedle? I guess the Weedle. Zero plus powers is actually fine. Got the paralysis anyway. There's my Dark Muck! A uh, little fucking daylight dollar short every time. I'll sit on the last energy, and I'll use a plus power now. Do I potion? I guess I can potion, now that I'm killing this thing. Magmar came out, it has Fire Punch, the potion was wasted. Alright, we Weedle. He still has three prices to draw, I just have to kill this thing. Can 
Okay, not so good luck. But I think I just win, right? Um, right? Razor Leaf plus plus power. Oh, that was close. My grass deck is doing a lot of work. I didn't know it would end up being a fire guy I was fighting, but fortunately he had a bunch of cards that couldn't easily... Like, his Charmander couldn't attack because he had no fire energies. Or he had, like, a few. I love how these guys are so kind that they just give me... Yo, that Dark Dog Trio! Sinkhole and Knockdown. Whoa. Damages when they retreat. That's pretty fun. Oh, the opponent flips. And if they get tails, they take more damage. Instead of me flipping and getting heads for more damage. I don't know why they're doing it like that. Vanish. Goofy ass bullshit. Discard? You've got to discard a psychic energy to even use this. That's not even good. What the fuck? I'd rather just use Psyshock. Psyshock wasn't a move, amusingly, when this game was made. This Diglett, I love it. Potion energy. This, I think, heals 20 HP and then counts as a white energy. When I was a kid, I thought these energies, these white ones, I thought they counted as anything. So I would literally, like, use double colorless energy and then use stuff like Flametail from Ponyta. I was just breaking the rules. I thought it was just, a, like, a wild card energy. They ended up making a wild card energy later on. It's called Rainbow Energy. Just counts as every energy type. Which, um, it's good if you've got a multicolor deck, but I think most people use single color decks. That Mankey! Kino! This is better than a Mankey I could draw. Mischief and Anger. That's pretty funny. That's not utterly useless, but it's mostly useless. But it's got the lowest cost it could possibly have, so whatever. I think in current Pokemon, there are certain moves that don't have a cost at all. But they're still not, like... Um, they're not Pokemon powers. They're just, like, moves with no energy cost. I think a lot of the baby Pokemon have no energy cost moves. Flip a coin if heads this attack this 20 additional damage. That's quite good. That's actually quite a good move. How much HP? 40? Eh, that's not a bad card. Yo, different Magikarp. What we got? Flop and Rapid Evolution. Flop for 10 damage, and it's got 30 HP, which is horrible. So that's already bad. But you can literally just, like... The thing is, you have to use this as a move. So it's not as easy as just putting Magic Magikarp on your bench and putting three water energies on it. You've got to bring it out and then consume your turn using Rapid Evolution on it. But, you know, you might also just draw your Gyarados and fucking put it on the Magikarp. Magikarp's a bad mon. Lost Isle Booster Pack. Is this some fossils or something? We got Vileplum. Vileplum's fossil, right? No struggle. That makes sense. It's a different Poliwhirl. Twiddle? This thing's twiddling things? Ew. Oh. Pretty decent. Oh, oh my god, status monster. Love that fucking Slowpoke, dude. Look at him. Slowpoke is me. We got a regular Grimer. If I put the regular Grimer into my deck, um, it increases my chances of playing Dark Muck someday. But I want the, I want the cool Grimer. Yeah. He freed them. I skipped the animation for it, but now I'm a little sad because it probably plays once per playthrough. Oh well. Punish deck. And a water coin. It's cool looking. He's in the fire club now. Please be a water deck. Oh, yes! 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 I'll probably not even adjust this. I'll probably just use it. I should be able to just go in there. Oh, it's... Um, it's pretty good. I don't want the Magikarp and the Gyarados. Gyarados is not a bad mon, but I don't I don't like that. i definitely rather have the other Magikarp. Let's fuck around with it. We'll see if we can make it work. Star you and Star me is quite good. War Turtles and no Squirtle. Oh, four Squirtles. Uh, we'll take out all the fires. This will be a water only deck. And I will throw in. 
Let's try the new Squirtle. Ew! Ew! It's worse. It's not as strong. It's cheaper. It's got attacks of the same energy cost as the fucking Squirtle it evolves from. It's not bad. It's definitely really cute. Um, what else did I want to throw in here? I'll throw in another Starmie. I'll just throw in extra energies. What the fuck is this? Who snuck their way in? Eevee? Farfetch'd, no. Trainers. I'll chuck in an energy removal just cause. Some potions, I guess. This is probably fine. Alright, throw in some energies. Okay, I still have six fire energies, so there's gotta be something I can do. So in some normal types. Sure. Oops, I didn't. I modified it before I saved it. Console exclusive dittos? What? That's a thing? Do you mean like Game Boy exclusive, as in they're not TCG mons? Or do you mean I have to, like, hook it up to an N64? They could have died. <gasps> Ronald! I didn't save! I'm gonna make a save state. And I'm gonna see if I reroll the RNG if I fail. Fuck, dude. Oh, wait, he gave me a... Booster pack. Oh, thank god. I got so scared I thought I had to fight him. I didn't save. Whew. Where was I? Fire deck. Fire club. Okay, I think I already talked to everyone in here. Roland. What is this bullshit? Is that a cage that they're all trapped in? There's Ken. I recognize Ken. I don't know the other guy's names. Mental trauma. Please have a fire deck so I can just crash through. Star is a good mon. If he leads with like a fucking fire mon with less than 50 HP, I could just dab on him. Unfortunately for me, he led with a grass mon. But all is not lost. I just have to not be paralyzed a zillion times in a row. I'm going to go a little yellow. Let's see what we got. It was perhaps a mistake to do that. Because he can just paralyze me over and over. But maybe he'll eventually stop paralyzing me over and over. I guess I'll set up the fucking Magikarp, right? Okay, this is horrible all of a sudden. What now? Oh, just put on another star you. Duh. We're good. Nothing is bad. Everything is good. It's a bit unfortunate that he just got to do that. Alright. Keep setting up the Magikarp. Evolve it, I suppose. I can cure my status by evolving. But I need some... Look at all my fucking... I drew two Squirtles. Well. What do I go out into? Radicate, I suppose. Energy removal? Sure. Should've done the Dark Chameleon, maybe? A Water Energy? I might as well put it here. Just so I can get some damage going. Yeah, I knew I was gonna get some more. Well, now I've got the Gyarados waiting in the wings, so, you know. That looks good anyway. I guess I set up the War Turtle now. Ah, uh, I don't know what I want to do. 
Alright, yeah, let's go into the Gyarados and start wrecking shop. Dragon Rage has no secondary effect, right? Yeah. Alright. Set up the War Total. Oh, wait, my Gyarados is just gonna fucking donk, isn't it? What's gonna stop my Gyarados from just donking? Okay, it could just get paralyzed over and over, I guess. I guess if it gets paralyzed, um, you know, six times in a row or something. Am I really weak to grass? Why would they do that? This thing is quad weak to electric and doesn't isn't weak to grass. Why would they make its weakness grass? It has a resist to fighting. That's really cool. I didn't know that. It's one of the OG cards. I never really fucked with it that much because I don't like... Um, I don't like Magikarp. Uh, I just kill this, thankfully. And now I set up another Starmie. Iron Grip. Alright, well he got his kill. I think I win with the Starmie. So we'll just get the War Turtle to just kind of, you know, do something to wound this. Oh, maybe I just win with the... That would have killed me. That would have actually... I would have died. The Starmie would have killed it after, probably. No, I don't have a... Oh, I got lucky. I don't have a plus fire. Dark Gyarados. I think that's the first Dark card I ever saw. Final Beam. My Dark Gyarados is knocked out by an attack, flip a coin. If heads this power, does 20 damage for each water energy attached to it. And its other attack is pretty good, too. This might justify... I don't know, Gyarados has to be really good to justify how bad Magikarp is. I don't know if this one's good enough to justify Magikarp. That final beam is really good. 30 damage plus paralysis chance is also really good. It's the atrocious Pokemon. That I'm a nice Kino. The Kabuto is also Kino. All evolutionary cards. That's weird. The Machop is nice. Punch and kick. They were just like, fuck it for this card. They didn't give a damn. Now, what kind of attack should we give Machop? How about punch and kick? Neither of them have a side effect. Oh my god, they actually. This is a zero effort card. We got another fucking Kino Grimer. Yes, finally. Another muck. That hypno, I don't I don't like it. Whoa. Wow. You can turn your Clefairy dolls into fucking other hypnos. The Clefairy doll should still have ten HP, so it's iffy. This polywag. It's the original polywag, but it looks funny. It's because of the new colorations. I had a million of these in my deck. Regular Grimer. Alright. Take Fire Coins, Charmander. Got all the coins. So I'm going to modify my starter deck. And put in the new Grimer. I don't know what I'm taking out. Something. Something's coming out. A Caterpie? I like the Bulbasaur more than I like the Caterpie and Metapod. Taking out something. The two Professor Oaks are kind of iffy. All these cards do work. I could just take out an energy. That feels kind of iffy, but, you know, we'll be alright. 21 energy is still a lot. Everyone's talking about how badly they want to duel with me. Alright, will Ronald ambush me? No. So, I, like, chased away one of the guys, and then didn't go to where he ended up.
Where haven't I had a boss fight? I don't remember. Still useless. Did everything there. Did everything here. No. Wait, fighting club? I think I confused Matthew and Michael. And now here I am fighting one of them. Weedle's a great early game mon because nothing has energy set up so nothing can retreat so you just kind of poison stuff and pray. I got the new Grimer! I got another new Grimer! Rolling in Grimery. Okay, I'm getting hella tail wagged right now. What do I set up? A Grimer? Do I have a Weedle? Yeah, I'll set up the Weedle. It's greedy, but I'll do it. And he quick attacked me. I'm being punished immediately for my greed. I could Oak and then pray for a... Um, let's do that. Fuck it. Kakuna. I got it. Full heal. Classic. Ivysaur. And then I set this up and I'm looking good. Porygon is always fun. Killed it in one turn. Look, got low kicked. Ivysaur is all set up though. If I had a plus power, that'd be swell. He's got four Machops with one energy each. I respect. Energy removal, sure. Alright, I'm confident that one's going to become a Dark Muck someday. Do I really just burn trying to get a Dark Muck? Fuck it. Didn't get it. Well. I don't know what I want to set up. It doesn't matter. I'm just going to... I've only got one prize left to draw. I just attack him and I win. Beedrill. That's good to get another one, actually. I should put that in my deck. This is now officially a Weedle deck. Alright. This is a super good start. This thing is weak to grass. And he turn one fucking... There's my Dark Muck. Okay. He energy removaled me twice. That's kind of a dick move, but I do have an energy retrieval, so I can just get them back. Fuck this Metapod. Oh my god, I can't hit him. I should have evolved. Ah, the karate chop. I'm gonna lose. I have to do this. This is ugly. I'm gonna lose, like 100%. This is really ugly. Alright, I got the clutch. Whoa, he gust of winded me into the fucking... Oh my god. I got really unlucky at the start of that one, fuck. I got like three tails in a row that let him set up like a million energies. When he was dead in like one attack. Alright, but this time I'm feeling more lucky. Yo, this coin needs to be patched. Ah, oh, Dark Muck, so long. Oh, this is his only card. I've got a decent chance of just winning on the spot. Oh, I did it. Alright, revenge. Turn three win.
Lapras, the new one. Sing and Surf. I don't think I've looked at this execute. No, it's the it's the jungle execute. Dugong, it's a classic. It's quite a decent card, but it's very slow to set up. Seal is a really garbage Pokemon. It's got a lot of health and um, only one attack that does 10 damage. And then Dugong requires an ass ton of energies. Once you actually have it set up, it's really good. What's the sign say? I recognize the characters. Surely he didn't go to the Pokemon Dome. That's number five. All right, we can figure this out. Oh, yeah. Did I never fight this guy? I just beat Murray and then stopped. Are you kidding me? I just forgot. I literally just fought Murray and then left. Hilarious. All right, leave with the Grimer. I don't even care if he dies turn two. I'm weak to Psychic with this Grimer. Grimer was the worst possible thing to lead with. I will touch him, though. Seventy is the magic number I find for, um... Oh, I got another Grimer. We're good. I need a Weedle. Give me a goddamn... There it is. There's my Weedle. Kakuna and Grass Energy. Looking pretty good. Should I plus power? Fuck it. Okay. Guillotine! Krabby! What just happened? Jesus Christ. Got my Dark Muck. Got my Grimer and my Dark Muck. It's my only chance ever to actually get this combo off. What's going on? Whew. I think his best play is actually going for the paralysis. I think it's good for me to put the energy on this of all things. A lot of energies right now. So what's the... I remember Dark Muck being really good. What's going on? That's right. Permanent poison and they can't retreat. Set up the Weedle. This thing dies to a tackle and I can't really keep it alive very easily. I have an Ivysaur, and I've got enough energies to set up, so I guess I'll work on that. Whoa. Got Switch, that's kind of good. Double Slap, got one flip. Um, this is fine. I could Professor Oak right now. I don't think I will, but I could. Set up the Dark Muck. I'm going to cry when I draw a... Uh, yeah, I'll do it. Drew my drill, just as I thought. I'm... I got so many energies right now. Poison Sting. What is this fucking... What is this drowsy? Long Distance Hypnosis. Defending Pokemon is now asleep. With Tails, your active Pokemon is now asleep. He didn't use it? Why am I not asleep? And he isn't either. Maybe he put himself to sleep and then woke up between turns. I have Switch anyway, so I could have just gone into... No, I don't have Switch. That's right. Alright, 50% chance to win on the spot. Oh, I didn't get it. It's never easy. Alright, 100% chance to win on the spot. I loosed! Incredible. Whoa, Ambition. Dark Slowbro. Challenge! I've never heard of this card. What the fuck? How does this work in this game? Do the opponents always accept, always decline, or is it just random? 
Did they actually have AI coded? I don't like that. Dark Slowbro. Reel in and Fickle Attack. Holy shit! Isn't that really good? You can just redraw a bunch of things that are dead. Oh, that's kind of shitty, though. Its only attack is really iffy. This Dark Haunter. Yo, I like it. Harass. This is a Game Boy exclusive. See, all the... You can't have randomly selected in real life. That's good though. 0 0.1 kilograms. Hunter and Ghastly are tied for the lightest Pokemon. I think there's another one as well, Cosmoam. Cosmog. I think Cosmog is also 0 0.1. Multiple Bone Hit. Feels like there was a better and more concise way to name that attack. Holy shit, this is truly random. Oh, but it always does 20 to the opponent. Alright. Not too bad. Bill's Teleporter. That seems decent. It's like Bill, but random chance. Poison Gas 100? Nope, 50. This Dratini. It's... Uh, yeah, I guess it's better than the base set Dratini. Not really. It's about equally good. Dark Persian, fascinate. Classy cat Pokemon. Super Scoop Up. Whoa! Just straight into the hand. I think Scoop Up just saves the base Pokemon. It doesn't save the evolution cards. And I don't think it saves the energies. But this one saves the evolutions and the energies too. But Scoop Up is guaranteed, and this is 50 50. Sleep. That seems fine. Clefable. Never seen this Porygon. 3D attack and conversion 2. Is this a child drawn one or is this just really like official? I don't like that card. All the Porygon cards are like super weird and gimmicky. Didn't someone want a Gloom? I got a Gloom. No, it's not on my list. The final coin piece. I can't tell if the game is about to wrap up or if they're going to be like a metal subplot too. Also, I didn't save. Alright, let's, let's do this again. Oh, no, we got in booster packs. Computer search, decent. Polyworld, fine. This Lickitung is gross. Lick and stomp. Lickitung in Gen 1 did not know Lick. How does that make you guys feel? I think it got it eventually, but I didn't have it in Gen 1. A bit cursed, in my opinion. Bunch of these. Who the fuck is this guy? No one's here anymore. I probably have to reset the game to fight his thing. Alright, let's save. I like how they just like let me come along. Do we have another overworld? Oh shit. We actually seem to have another overworld. Shit, shit, shit. There's no way they would design it like this unless I could actually visit all these places. Holy hell. This game is something else. I was thinking it might be almost over. Alright. So I get free passage to and from. Is 
is everyone here wants me dead? Is that what's going on? Game Center, Sealed Fortress, GR Grass, GR Electric, Challenge Hall. Okay, so we've got fortresses in place of the clubs. And I can't visit any of these places. Colorless Altar? Ishihara's house again? He's in both. I can go as far as here. Guess I'll check out the game center and see what's going on. Ronald's here. Whoa. Bill's computer. I don't know what's going on here. And you cannot use this card in play. He got fucking sidetracked by the gold saucer or whatever the meme is. Alright, this is a little cursed. I didn't want something like this in the game. Wow. These GR people are just fucking bashing me. I've got save states, so whatever the games are like, I can just use save states probably. Ten chips. Thank you. Wow. Jigglypuff coin. Bill's computer. That's the one I just got given. Me level 15 and Venusaur. Are those all the prizes? Okay. Let's take a look. Ten heads in a row is, like, impossible. What the fuck? Alright, can I use save states to break this? Oh, I can. Alright, let's break it immediately. Fuck yeah. How are you gonna... How many attempts? One in 2,000? Something? One in 1024? You've done it. That would be horrible to unlock on console. Just play that game over and over 2,000 times. Bill's computer. What's going on here? The black box. Through the mail. Mailbox space. How do I win more chips? This is just ways to get cards. Five chips. Alright, so do I time my presses? Do I have to... oh. Alright, can I have timed my presses? Alright, well... I won. So do I just do this over and over? And just scum. Like that. How the fuck do you get three rainbow? Seems like that would never happen. It's possible that you can um, push the A button to alter the RNG. Oh, I won a lot. I'm I'm winning. The odds seem decent here. Give me the three rainbows. I'm like getting net chips just hold, hitting down. What the fuck is this? The odds actually seem decent. I'm 
I'm up to 200. Mashing down. Now I'm just losing. But not, not really. 300. How the fuck do you get three rainbows? 400. 2000 looks very feasible to get just hitting down in this game. 444 is kind of unlucky. 500? It seems like the odds are better to win than lose. Whoa, bonus game. I got here. 1000. Okay. You know, I got a lot of chips. This is really strange. That the odds of winning are this good. I can just save state anytime I break a new hundred value. And then if I drop another hundred value, I just fucking like here, this is a decent time. Twelve hundred. Eighteen hundred. This is kind of goofy. I'll get to two thousand once. I guess I should save while I've got seventeen hundred. Then I'll check out the other games. There might be one that's even easier to win using save states. I don't even need save states for this one. I just need to hit down. I almost broke two thousand. I could just use an in-game cheat. I could just use cheats. Was this? Is this just other slots? One chip. These are the penny slots. I don't want to do penny slots. Card dungeon. Didn't even tell me how it works. Fuck it, I'll do it. Wager chips against many hard dungeon. Oh, okay, so this is save state abuse times a million. This isn't a ROM hack. This is just the sequel. This is Pokemon Trading Guard Game 2. It was a Japan-only game, so you have to play a translated ROM. So I guess technically it is a ROM hack. But it is a real game, it's just translated. What? I have to win? Okay, this is actually... This is what I wanted. We're playing cards. So it's just going to continuously double? I wonder how high it'll go. Can I just say... It's a fucking Magmar! I can't even enter your removal alert or anything. What's what's Oh I hate this. He can only do twenty damage to me on the first turn. I won't die. He didn't even have an energy, thank god. Please, Grimer, you're my only card that's not weak to fire. Alright, good start. Fucking Moltres. Ugh. That's all I gotta say. Alright, we poisoned it. That was super good luck. And I just killed it too. I hate this. Please poison it. Okay, there it is. Another Weedle, sure. Can I end your removal this oh maybe the Chansey actually? I'll make a decision. Well it just killed me. It's that Kangaskhan. I'm not ready for that. I could gust of wind him into something else. Kangaskhan has a really high retreat cost, doesn't it? But I can gust of wind him into the other Kangaskhan. Yeah, three. He probably is trapped in it. And then I can just slowly kill him. Hope he doesn't have a switch. Oh, 
Oh my god, can I get heads? I have one, though. Mm, just all tails, but it didn't matter. Take these chips. I guess I'll advance. How good are the decks going to be? It looks like I can save in the room before the fight. Doesn't that kind of break it? He was just like a fucking ranger. Please don't let them all have um, fire decks. Another Kangaskhan. It's got a lot of mysterious. He just played how many mysterious fossils? What? Time out. Two. Okay, never mind. That's still a bit weird. Tail dropped me. I don't care about that. Oh, I'm getting a little lucky with these flips. I don't know what to set up. I'll put it off. Oh my god, I'm getting real lucky with the flips. Oak. And he's only got the mysterious fossil. Wait. Isn't that kind of good for me? I'm going to oak. Gust of Wind him into the other mysterious fossil, and then kill that one. Please just don't have... Yes, he doesn't have anything! Yes! Oh, Alright, this is the knight. Alright, there probably won't be more than five then, huh? Six. I think there's six separate chess pieces. This is the bishop. The powerful bishop. 30. Belbazor. Porygon is a mon I'm always happy to see. I could potentially kill it next turn. I'm a little wary of how much damage he just did to me. He only has one other mon, and it's the fucking extremely dangerous Scyther. If he has double colorless energies, I'm in actually a world of hurt. I actually just lose on the spot if he plays a double colorless energy. Oh, he did. Just like that. Alright, that didn't happen. Cool, you really just can cheese this. That's hilarious. There's this whole, like, betting thing, but you can just, like, you know, save in front of each one. That's pretty bad luck, I guess. I don't know, maybe his whole deck is oriented around that. Maybe it wasn't bad luck at all, maybe it was completely ordinary luck. Okay, this guy's got a lot of energy removals, but I've got a lot of energy, so I don't have to care. Kind of annoying, though. Drew my cool Grimer. It's time to start setting up the Bulbasaur. Whoa. I guess we're going into the Bulbasaur. This new bat's cool. Favorite Poker Girl? Dark Muck. How's he doing that? What's going on here? Oh, okay. Every time it comes out, we both switch. That's pretty goofy, but not super dangerous. Uh, time to wait for a Weedle. I got one. And your achievable is good for them, not for me. Uh, the fact that I'm poisoned is so annoying. Let's try for a paralysis, damn it. It's a need drill. If I had a plus power, that'd be so nice. Tween Needle can kill. Poison Sting. Tween Needle needs two heads to kill. Poison Sting only needs one head to kill. And I got the head. How would I not say yes? So this is the Rook. Yep. That sprite reminds me very strongly of Dragon Warrior Monster sprites. 
30 or 50. That's a rook. Colorless energy deck. Intriguing. If it's a bunch of Kangaskhans, that's kind of scary. Okay, it's fucking... It's Dratini. Hold up. I could, like... This is a, this is a slow setup deck. I have to win fast. Alright, time to revise my opinion, since apparently it's a fucking Pidgey deck, too. Or Spira, whatever that was. I think I saw Fira there for a second. Five? Any, I've never seen a five prize game in my life. Alright, set up uh, Bulbasaur. Did he just use a full heal energy and then not even attack? Marnie's cute. Moonstone. I don't know what a moonstone is. I wish I'd looked at it. Wow, cool. He's got weird energies. Does he only have, like, colorless energies in his deck? Can you do that? Are there enough colorless energies? Probably can't use Whirlpool. Thank God, because Whirlpool is a really good move in the TCG. Yeah, I mean, in the in the game it does. Also the Nidos, and also, I think, Skitty. And there's like one more. Muna, maybe? I think there's another one still. There's a lot of weird evolutions of the Moonstone. We're playing some Pokemon. Look at all the fucking standard Pokemon on the field. Such as, um... Okay, he has a double colorless. I, I, that's one of the best energies to remove. I might as well. I could guess to win him into something else. There's no point yet. Jakuna on the Weedle. Grass energy on the Weedle also looks good. Potion on me seems fine. Yellow is cringe and stupid. Alright, my team is extremely set up at this point. I don't think I can lose anymore. Alright. Dragonair is actually extremely scary, and I can definitely lose. I can just wail on it until it kills me, and then I wail on it with something else. I don't really have to set up anything else, but I guess I'll set up another Weedle. I'd probably live or die on the team I've already got. Okay. My Metapod is hanging on super well. During my cool grammar. I think I can win right here. Retreat into the B drill, and then plus power, and then poison sting. Cool. Yes. And the queen awaits. Whoa. Do I have to fight her across the thing, or do I just talk to her? Mm, I have to talk to her. Bullshit. Hi, queen. Oh, there's no door ahead, or maybe that is a door. I can't tell. Okay, yeah, this is the final room. The queen. <laughs> I'll be the king. 50 or 100. Six prizes. Okay. We got a full battle ahead of us. Drew Bulbasaur and Ivysaur, it's kind of good. Bulbasaur is a better early game mon in this game than it was in the last game. Or this Bulbasaur is better, rather. I drew a Weedle too. I got Kakuna and Ivysaur waiting in the wings. I just need more energies. This is looking pretty good so far. Whoa, the switch. But I think that's fine. I think I'm going to start kicking ass. I feel like I should force out the Electabuzz. Whatever. What do I set up? The Kakuna, I suppose. Alright, I got pretty lucky. Okay. I think it might be good to um, try and heal. I only got 1 HP back. How much damage does to do? Okay, that 1 HP actually matters. 
Alright, well, it didn't matter. I still die to two heads, so now I just attack. Only one head. Another Ivysaur, right? Yeah. I guess we start setting up the Bulbasaur. I guess I Leech Seed to get some HP back. Ah, uh, Thunder Punch. It's annoying. Energy removal is good. What the fuck energy is this? It's the rainbow. Take that away. Don't like him having that. I think I draw the energies I dr dropped. Should have oaked, actually. This is a little sketchy, but I think I just win, right? Wait. Wait. No, I've still got so many energies to fucking... I mean, so many prizes to draw. I'm dumb. Muck. Ah. Uh. Damn it. That was shitty. Alright, another Weedle. Do I have Bulbasaur? No. Smog. I didn't die, thankfully. But I could have. Drew my B drill. Oh, my motherfucker. Things are going just not super well. Oh my god. Not super well. Do I have to... Hmm. I gotta think about my turn. How many prizes? Two. Alright, well, this is not too bad. I think I have to play the Professor Oak, though. I could Grass Energy up. I could play the Oak. I could Gust the Wind in first, is the thing. That seems to be the play. No, she's poisoned. Grass Energy first, pray for a Metapod. Grammar's decent. Got the Metapod. Alright, we're back in this. No Weedles, though. The dream would be drawing a fucking... Oh my god. A Weedle. Gust of Wind into one of the nearly killed Pokemon, and I win. Close game, but I won. So I only lost once, and it was to, like, fucking Knight. Or Bishop is to Bishop. I concede defeat. 200 chips. That was... I mean, I think that was decent, but it was nowhere near as good as the slots. And now I've played every game here. So I can grab the Venusaur or the Mew. Let's grab the Venusaur. So I probably have to do that again to grab the Mew. Whoa. Probably have to play a lot more games because I want it, the Bill's computer. But getting another 2000 seems like it's going to be pretty slow. I could just do this on my own time or just use a cheat or something. It'd be a lot less boring. Oh, bonus game. Alright, well that's a lot of money. Maybe it'll be fast. I can't believe this just generates coins. There's something weird about that. That your chances of winning are just that high. I don't need to load my state ever. I'm almost up to 1500. This is so goofy. I like it like this. I prefer it like this to... Um, you know, slots that you can't win. I think I've lost over a hundred just now. Let's get some good luck. That's some good luck.
Oh, that's some super good luck. I remember having a really hard time getting, um... Oh, okay. I remember having a really hard time getting, uh, Porygon. Alright, that was actually pretty fast. I will take your Mew. What's the present pack? I want to know what that is. Alright, I'll win one more. Oh, I want the Jigglypuff coin too. Alright, 700 doesn't take that long to get. I think the higher price of this slot machine is to scare you, but actually it's like super busted. Alright, I'm actually fixing to lose. Alright, that was a little scary. I got low. Get low, get low, get low. Alright, can I win some hundreds? There we go. That's a bit better. I'm in a good mood. I don't work today. I might try and see all my friends. Who here has friends? I'm in a super good mood because just the other day I went jogging with one of my friends and it was my first time jogging with him in ages. And I always feel really... Um, it's not It's not really even boring to go jogging. Whoa. I accidentally hit my space bar and opened up my... I accidentally hit my Windows key, by the way. Anyway, um, I don't even find it boring to go jogging, and then I feel accomplished for the next, like, three days. I will probably not buy DNF Duel, unless, like, something crazy changes my mind. There is only ever one game I'm looking forward to at any given time. Actually, there's two for me right now. There's Street Fighter VI and Dragon's Dogma 2. Alright, 900 is a great time to stop. I was going to go a little bit higher, and then I got a bunch of 100 wins in a row. Alright, we'll get the coin, and we'll get the fucking present pack, see what the present pack is. Alright, what's the present pack? Alright, it's a booster pack. With Raichu. What is this, Bulbasaur? It's cool looking. Oh, guaranteed poison, but no attacks. This Machop is Kino. Mega Kick and 1-2 Punch. That's pretty fun. I've never seen this Nidorina. Strength in numbers. Nidorina always has like this like draw other Nidorina thing going on. Yeah, look at that. For every Nido, you do more damage. They want you to build a full Nido deck. Excuse me. I don't know how you get more coins. They didn't seem to be a way. Didn't seem to be a way to buy, buy, buy chips. So what's going on with the fortresses? This one's sealed. Okay, so I guess I come back. Grass fortress. Whoa. I don't even get to fucking... I just walk in. No energies, bad start. I guess I'll play some of my many fucking active basic Pokemon. He look the Grimer. The face off. Bulbasaur, I suppose. Alright, got another energy. Oh, I got poison too. I got the Ivysaur. That seems good. This is a fine chance to Professor Oak. I can't really do anything. I guess I'll just sit here. Poison Claws. The Caterpie? I guess the Caterpie is the best one to build up. Gust of Wind is good. Oh, this is this is super good. I might just win right here. How many prizes are we playing for? Six? Jesus Christ. But I've already won, honestly. Like, what can you do to come back from this? You just got a bunch of Mons that you fucking have no energies, and I'm just killing them one by one. They all have low HP. This is already GG. Famous last words. No, I've actually won. I've sort of clinched it. 
I'm convinced Capcom Oops didn't mean to the whole roster. It's not the first time they've done that. Whoa, it's Ronald. I just had a fucking surprise Ronald boss fight. Rocket sneak attack with tits right on the fucking cover. Recycle energy, I forgot about this one. Yo, this Chansey. Soul. Only two coins for double slap. Dark Starmie. Rebirth and Spinning Shower. I hate it. Goop Gas Attack? That's pretty funny. This Psyduck. Psyduck always has two different energy requirements. Draw a card. They really want you to use a water psychic deck just to use fucking Psyducks? I mean, it's always. You'd never have to use the psychic move. I'm picturing some kid who put a single psychic energy into his deck with four Psyducks in it. It's just like, well, if I draw the psychic energy, I can use the psychic move. Uh, NBC 3, I remember. I don't remember what happened with NBC I. Cross and I think so. I don't remember. Ah, too much discarding. The evolution spray, I already have one of those. That Ekans is kind of cool. Pretty decent. Not great. I've seen all the others. Whoa. Special dueling rules? I'm scared. We've got so many clubs in this game. Dark Venusaur. Gile's cool as fuck in every single game. What about Gal hyped you this time, but not other times? There's only one person in here. I don't know why I saved state instead of just saving the game. Fight me to open the gate. Oh, I'm freeing the psychic guy. SO6 does look good. It looks fun. It looks like they're taking good stuff and leaving bad stuff. So we got the parry as the new universal reskill. Ryu just gave his parry to everyone. And then Vyarose is still in with a new name. And the new meter system is pretty interesting. What's the command for the... the attack? Is it both heavies? For the guard point attack? What's the deal with that? Someone fill me in. I didn't watch the footage. Um... Is it always lead to a combo, or does it only lead to the combo on a cornered opponent? I heard that it gives a wall splat in the corner, but I don't know the difference in the rules. Let's leave with Weedle. Got the bubble sore. Weedle's gonna do some work, though. Fucking Kino ass Meowth. I've already killed. I'm gonna be greedy. I guess I stiffen here. You don't usually use that move. You just dead the poison. Oh, that was her only Mon. Holy shit, what a fight. Does it give us stun only in the corner or anywhere? If they're out of out of drive. Scyther is a good ass card. Dark War Total. I remember this one very distinctly. I imagine it's parryable. You can also probably just do your own one if they do it, but probably the parry's better. A universal parry and a universal guard point attack is actually a bit similar to um, Street Fighter EX. And also it's very similar to the game Until My Death hit video game that I'm sure Capcom copied. I imagine you could do your own fucking impact as well, drive impact. The parry probably gives you any punish. 
Drive impact probably just gives you the fucking damage of a drive impact. I hate this card. I would never use that. Got another the Grimer. I did my best. I have no regrets. So here's the science guy. Snorlax. Hungry Snorlax. Eat and roll out. Pokemon eat. Swallow is actually a move in the Pokemon games. One food counter? Food counter. Remove as many food counters. 20 damage plus 30 more for each food counter. That's actually very much like um, stockpile and then spit up. That's pretty cool. Return to the science club. Another name. GR number one. This is kind of cool. It's humanizing them. It's like... It's like James from Team Rocket, almost. Alright, we got a Grass Duel. These would be easier fights if I was just constantly bringing the opponent weaknesses, which I could do, I think. What the fuck was that first turn? I drew my Dark Muck immediately. Okay, he switched. I'm a little bit scared. Got the very small number of fucking basics I drew. Got another Weedle. I'm three Weedles deep already. Professor Oak. A Metapod. He frightened me, which I forget what that does. No trainer cards. Alright, well, that's mildly annoying. I couldn't Oak even though I wanted to, but I don't want to. Potion? I think that... I still can't use that though, right? Yeah, because of Frighten. This is Dark Ivysaur. It's pretty cool looking. Poisoned it. Very, 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 very lucky. It's, oh, I can't Potion because I got Frightened. Motherfucker. Wait, when did I get into this fucking Weedle? I thought I was in the other Weedle. Hmm. I win on the spot if I can just get a poison. I got it. Why were there only four prizes? That felt like a boss fight. Mr. Mime. I'll open the doors. Liz? What the fuck is this layout of this gym? It's just a bunch of fucking rooms in a row. GR Grass Coin. How many coins? Whoa, she cute. Cater Pie. This time I got all the Kakunas I was denied last game. Uh, that was a... Oh, I just lose. I literally just lose. Oh my god, I just lose. Draw a fucking basic, please. I lose. I literally lose. Alright, that was shitty. Alright, let's try that again. I drew a fucking single Caterpie and got poisoned turn one. What am I supposed to do with a single Caterpie? I will touch you back, asshole. I'll touch this thing too. Everything getting touched. Okay, this thing dies if I hit it. Gust of wind is good. Poison gas is horrible.
I guess I just plus power. Oh, my professor. Oh, my plus power again. That way I don't need luck. And then I set up the Bulbasaur. I got the luck anyway. Alright. That, um... That Charmander's here. The Ivysaur. We energy retrieve. Fuck the switch. Hope I don't regret that. Alright, I think I won, right? Yeah. Oh dear, it seems I've been bested. She must have polite speech. I didn't even look at the cards. Alright, please be the last room. GR. Has the appearance of the last room. This place is weird. Are they all going to be this long? Chlorophyll. Grass-type Pokemon can't be statused. Well, that works for me too. But it also doesn't work for me because my poison doesn't work. Kills a lot of my strats. I can still paralyze this. I feel like he's successfully setting up some mons. I'm a little scared. I'll save the energy. I'd rather set up something else. A lot of fucking drawing by my opponent. This is really scary. See, I've got an opponent's... Um, I've got a stage 2 mod in front of me right now. Pedal Dance, how many flips? Three. And it can't be confused afterwards. Ugh. And I can't even paralyze it. Alright. This is horrible. Alright. I live now if I get a bad flip. Oh, I lived. I got the bad flip. Wish I had a plus power. That's a super cool strat. Caterpie? Fuck it, Caterpie. I thought about Ivysaur. But I think it's okay. What? Hay fever? What? That's annoying. He got so many draws off of this strat. Caterpie is useless in this environment. But I can kill this by a plume, so that's good. I need another, like... Oh, I can use my bill next turn, though. Ugh. Alright, but bill's here. Alright, another bill's here. Weedle. I'll take it. Uh, healing is good, I think? Energy removal. Not yet, maybe. Maybe good. I'll sit on it. Alright, I'm making rapid progress. Oh, I can I can win, right? I need a plus power. I can YOLO it. Let's YOLO it. I guess I'll use the energy removal since it's just gonna go away. No plus power for me. I can get some HP back. Oh, I just win. Alright, good game. It was a close one. He's sweating. That's a crying face. I seem to have lost. Jinx. This game is so much better than the first one, I'm fucking blown away. And the first one I love. This is a really good game. Alright, I finally got a new grass coin. But I like my Oddish. I really, like, feel my Oddish. I can't think of what coin would possibly convince me to use it instead of Oddish. No surprise duel. Electric Fortress. Weak to ground, probably. I don't want to build a fighting deck. I'll just go in with my existing strats. Circular coin size slot. It's kind of funny. 
before she needs to go through the minute order. A woman named Catherine. Right, she level 31. Peter. A cool deck. Alright. Whoa, he's cool looking. Ah, fuck. Alright, my evolution is a metapod, so I'll just play Caterpie first. I should have put down more bench Pokemon, that was almost horrible. Without, um, whoa. Without, um... I can't go for the Metapod. Without, uh... Oh my god, Beth, complete the thought. I can do this. Without Butterfree. Um, a Caterpie deck is not very good or interesting. Alright, I needed a energy, which I did not draw. I got it but things are looking very dire. But he has, his other mon doesn't have any... Oh my god. I think I just lose if he draws an energy. Alright, that was super annoying. Whoa. Only one Pokemon, it's the, the Zapdos that requires a zillion energies to use. This is really, really good luck for me. I think this is like, you know... Oh my god, you can only have four of those in your deck. Why does he have like a billion of them? This doesn't require three energies to use. Four. Alright, well that's annoying. Oh, do I just win? Alright, revenge for the last game. He turned away. That's funny. Venusaur. Classic. Metamoth. Good grass mons. I actually could put Venusaurs in my deck. It's worth looking at that. How many do I have? Got two different Venusaurs. That's tempting. That's like better than the Caterpies and the Metapods, I feel. I'm playing a dangerous game because I've got less basics. What a weirdo. Cassie. What? I have to play with four fucking Pikachus? Alright, well, time to make an electric deck, I guess. That's shitty. What's this one? Is this, this is the water one. I want to keep that one. I should have enough cards for... Uh, okay, well, I've got four Pikachus. Might as well throw some Raichus in there. Magnemite and Magneton? I don't even have Magneton. I don't have the Magnemite I like either, the one that explodes. These are both good. Everything else is horrible. I don't have... Well, I have a lot of electric energy. Fuck it. Chuck some of these guys in. I guess we'll just do the rest with... um. Oh, that's right. Stark Radicate, good. That's good enough. How many trainer cards can I chuck in there? I'll just destroy this deck when I'm done.
Fuck it. Good enough. The letter A. Uh. I like how they have names in English, but I don't seem to have the ability to do that. Alright, well, I got my electric deck. Alright, all Magnemites. I hate that she's got two electric energies, turn one. Alright, I want Pokedex. Does this reorder your... Yeah, I want to draw some energies. Alright, well, that makes it real simple. Ah! Not expecting that. Jesus Christ, I hate this. Got my flying Pikachu. I put rocket sneak attack in there, I didn't mean to do that. What's this? Eh, that's decent, I guess. Gust of wind, sure. Alright, successfully removed the energy. Oh no, this thing resists the electric, doesn't it? What a fucking... Uh. God damn it. I don't have anything to kill this. I have Rattata. Which is, I definitely should have gone into. Oops. I'm getting fucking owned. Gust of winded me into the Pikachu. Alright, new strat. We delete this deck. And then we um, just cram four Pikachus in here and say fuck it. Take the bills out and a switch. And just jam in four Pikachus. I'm mad. Stupid ass fucking rules. Alright, well, I drew one of my Pikachus right away. Bulbasaur is a good start. I'm not even going to place the Pikachu. I don't want it. Great start. Great start. Yeah, I can spin it on the Weedle. Oh my god, it's just getting better and better. Nice. Damn it. Alright, I have a very real chance of drawing a Kakuna, and if I do, I win on the spot. I'll do it. No Kakuna for me. Oh, now here it comes. Trolled. That would have been nice if I got it. Alright, this is going a lot easier. What a fucking forces you to use electric cards and then brings a bunch of ground mons. That's so mean. Wait, I have a beat drill. I can't use any attacks though because I have no no energies. Would have been nice. It's probably worth it to save this. Is this over? Yeah. And there's my energy. Dark Magneton. I've never looked at that, so I guess I'll look at it. That's fine. A 
Sonic Boom was a decent way of getting around, um... No, but I didn't have any... Steve, like the the master? The Elite Four? No. Oh, here we go. I shouldn't have broken down the fucking thing. Alright, let's take out the Pikachus. I think I took out Bills and a Switch. I want four bills. I can live with one switch. No, switch is good. I'll take three bills. In your deck. Um, okay, so all my electric energies. And then we want to bring as many normal types as possible. Because I honestly do not trust this game. Oh, I can do the wave. That sounds fun. I might get it off. Chances are really low, but you know, it'd be nice if it worked. I'll bring the Taros. The keg is gone. I'll just jam a bunch of um, Pikachu's in there. I'll try the Magnemites again. I'm feeling confident. I can cram 12 trainers. That's good enough. It's the R deck. Alright, let's try this again. Rattata? Sure. He goes first and instantly almost kills me. I'll try my luck, see if he doesn't have any energies left. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Okay. Nice heads. Oh, he self-destructed. Holy shit. Let's go into the Magnemite. He went to his Magnemite. I don't think I pulled any plus powers. It would be extremely dank right now if he... Um... Does this work for only my play, or does it work for him too? On my bench. Damn it. I can draw one more Magnemite. Which is still only 20 damage. If he kills me, he kills himself, right? Oh, we're both one prize. I don't know what's going to happen. I would love to just win, but I think I don't have the requisite. Plus power. Fuck it. Can Flying Pikachu do something? It can Thundershock him. That's a huge gamble. I'm going to save state because I don't know what's going to happen. Maybe he self-destructs. Oh, he didn't even try. Uh, I win. Alright. It might have been a... I might have got the pr prize first to be self-destructed. I don't know how that works. Scyther is a good card. I could put a bunch of those in my deck and a bunch of double colorless energies, so that would make my deck way better. 
Ooh, promotional electabuzz. Okay. That's the last one, huh? Increased by 10. Fucking hell. That's gonna be annoying. What can I possibly... Where are all these Scythers? I got two? I can make a little room for them. What am I taking out? Energy retrieval is kind of good. The potions are maybe not so good. Gust of Wind is invaluable. Switch? I kind of like Switch. Bill? I got six cards to take out. It's not going to be easy. Ivysaur? A Weedle, a Kakuna, a Beedrill? One of each? Feels a bit shitty, but Scythers are good. It'll help my early game. And then energy, I don't know. I have double colorless energy, so... Let's try with my base deck. This is definitely going to be harder. I should have led with the Scyther 100%. Should not have led with the, the grammar. But I think it's alright. Got my Weedle. Gust of Wind plus Scyther plus the, the power up it does is super busted. I guess I'll put on this energy now. Touch the Eevee. Energy remove the Dark Raichu, maybe. I don't know. So he's actually bringing a bunch of Mons that aren't, um,. Aren't electric, which brings me joy. In fact, I'm... Well, I didn't mean to do that, but I guess I'll monopolize on it. Capitalize. I definitely want to kill that thing, I think. Whoa, that's right. The flip I had to do. Play the drill. I've got all these Ivysaurs. I don't want a Professor Oak. That's super bad luck. I could touch this, or I could touch it, or I could touch it. Not for sticky hands. It was better, I think. There's my drill all set up. This is a surprisingly, like, kind battle. There just haven't been that many, um... Oh, I didn't have to use the switch. I had free retreat. That's annoying. Alright. This ended up being, like easy. Just because there were like no fucking electric types. Defeated using my own rules. Dark Arbok. She like didn't get any attacks off. 10 damage to that Pokemon. 100% chance of poison. Oh wow, that's really good. Only 10 damage is weak, but poison is good and doing 10 damage to everything is really good. Rainbow Energy, I finally got one. I love the art of Rainbow Energy. This really doesn't do it justice. It looks so cool. GR Thunder Coin. It's all you. Go, go, go. They're rooting for me. I'm going to go say hi to Ishihara. Why does Ishihara have a second house? Let me go there. 
we've got a water, fire, and fighting fortress. This is so weird. This game is huge. I love it. God, let me go to that one. Water Fortress. That should be pretty easy. Fire should be pretty hard. Magnemite. Okay, well, I picked one of the right ones at least. A woman named Brooke. I get it. Special battle rules again with this bullshit. Blastoise level 28. I haven't had like a single... trade card in advance. I've had one, I think. Lone girl battling my way up. Fire and water coins. Okay. When will I sleep? It's 6.46 a.m. right now. I, I, the, given how long this game has been, I probably shouldn't try and beat it in one go. One smooth dude. <sighs> water only. I already have a deck like that. I think. Yeah. Alright, well, let's just um, yellow it, and I don't remember what's in there, but, you know, it's probably good. I've got a, a bunch of... Whoa, he was... He was... He was a black. I did not guess that from the sprite. Caught me off guard. Show me his face again. There he is. Look at him. Cool. Who does that remind me of? Was Archie... Ar did Archie have dark skin? I don't remember. I think there's another Pokemon character. I mean, obviously not Nessa. There was someone else. Alright. An electric Pokemon is not what I like to see. But, you know, I can adapt. Improvise, adapt, overcome. How can she slap? I got a lot of water energies. How can she slap? Sure would be nice if I had some more basics. This is a goofy fight. I have a Starmie, right? Yeah. We're just trading Mons. Alright, that sucked. Why did she retreat? What the fuck was that about? Game bugged. So I think I just win after I get knocked out. Oh, that was smart, actually. Well, I win if I get the Confuse. Let's set up this magic card for no reason. I mean the paralysis. GG. Not too bad. Boost your pack. I didn't look at the wheezing. This guy's kind of like, I don't know. Didn't seem very happy to help me. Oh, this guy, there's like a path over there. Four Magikarp. Don't I have that? Uh, I don't. Well, that's an easy adaptation. Because I think I actually... I have the wrong Magikarp. Oh, there's no right Magikarp. Alright. I now have way too many... Wait. I now have way too many cards. What's coming out? Some normal types? That's too dangerous. I must have some useless shit in here. Trainer cards that do nothing. Oh, it's all the water energies. I don't need that many. I could have used my regular deck with just extra Magikarps. Lead with Rattata. That's a nice innocent Mon to lead with. He's got no Pokemon in the back. Oh my god, he led with Magikarp, and he has no extra Pokemon. If I had plus power, I won on the spot. Oh well. Oh, I, I do just win. G fucking G, dude. Great fight. Stupid Magikarp guy. Ooh, I've never seen this booster pack. There are too many booster pack types. Imposter Professor Oak. 
First time getting that in this run, I think. The fuck is this Weedle? Peck? Weedle? Peck? It's... Uh, it's... It's different from the Weedle I have. I could swap one of the Weedles for this Weedle and see if it's better. Yo, that's, that Vulpix art? It's kind of Kino. Is it a field? Foxfire. That's kind of cool. Not very good for your only attack. <laughs> Funny moves. You got two flips for 10 damage each. Or just a guaranteed 10. So here's another one of the Elite Four members from the last game. We had Steve, and now we got this guy. Please be a good Magikarp. 30 HP still, so all Magikarp so far have 30 HP. If at least one of them is Tails, this attack does nothing. Oh no. Cue the guy to come in with his fucking finger out and be like... You flip two coins, at least one of them is tails. What's the odds that they're both tails? And they just break everyone's brains. So that, I can't go back there, huh? I'll probably just go with my water deck. I can't have more than three Pokemon in my bench. Is he also bound to that roll? Alright, well I better choose them carefully. Such as this Grimer. And this Bulbasaur. Alright, time to poison him turn one. Yeah, you love to see it. Time to touch him. With my sticky hands. Wait, 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 wait. I think I'm trashing this guy. I got the Weedle Kakuna Beedrill combo as well. Dude, I don't even need all these fucking slots. I'm good as is. What's the point of a full team if I can just, like, you know... Oh, I won. It's a... It's a, a cruelly worded question. Except those I've never seen. I hate this. Every Zapdos is cancerous as hell. Oh my god, I hate this. How much HP? 70? Ah. Uh, Dark Dragonair. That's pretty good. That's pretty good too. Dragonair is usually good. What was I gonna say? Oh yeah, the, the question. Flip a coin if one of them is heads. No, one of them is one of them is heads. At least one of them is heads. That's the question. Flip a coin, at least one of them is heads. What's the odds that they're both heads? And the thing is, at least one of them is heads only rules out um, double tails. So there's heads, tails, tails, heads, or heads, heads. So the chances of two heads is actually one in three. Man-made Pokemon. It doesn't breathe. Water. That guy's a creep. I don't like him. This is just where you fight Zoma. I'm going to fight Zoma right after this. Brooke. She's going to send out Zoma. Adorable water Pokemon. Water Pokemon pay one less energy to retreat. That's very manageable. I can beat that. I don't care if she just retreats a lot. Well, actually, my poison strat is a little bit worse. But hey, maybe she has no bench Pokemon. Damn it. At least I'll be forcing her to switch a lot. Oh, I still do 10 damage, so it's whatever. Oh, this thing still can't retreat, because it's got a retreat cost of 2. Alright, well, this Grimer's going to win me the whole game. No point in continuing to add energies to it. I can't tell if there's a point to healing Bulbasaur. Please don't kill me somehow. Alright, we're alive. Grimer's a little wounded, but, you know, we're hanging on. I did not see that. Alright, touch the Starmie. 
think I just I think I just attack him. Oh, that was perf. Wait, wait, I'm winning. He has no energies. I've energy starved him. I just attack the I wish I had a fucking Ivy Sore. Better to poison it. Weedle. There we go. Now I can win. Nice fucking flips. You can't retreat if you're paralyzed. Energy removal from Articuno seems good. Why you an attack? Oh, there's my Dark Muck, dude. I will never use this. It's getting frustrating. Just force out his Goldeen and kill that. GG. Nice Articuno, idiot. Oh, she's crying. Oh, she's, she's cute. Tough cookie. I got another fucking Dark Muck. And I got another Grimer. I can slowly creep these guys into my deck. I've got three devolution sprays now. Water coin. I don't want the Scythe, so I should find mind about them. I like the I like the muck. God is my witness. Nah, I can leave a site there. God is my witness. I will um get this muck to do something. I guess they are. I guess they did steal these for it's Ronald. Good thing I saved. He always surprises you with fights, and then if you lose, you just permanently miss whatever fucking card he has. It's really cruel. Okay, he literally started with, um... Paymonchan, that's pretty annoying. I will touch it. Scyther would have been nice. It's gonna special punch me. Fuck it, I'm setting up the Grimer. Uh, Dark Muck just kills it. Oh, I won. That was his only Mon! Fuck yeah, that was close. Setting up the Grimer was the right play. Dark Muck finally did something. What is this? Computer error? <laughs> That's funny. It's a big hard. Good on turn one, anyway. Alright, this is a place where I actually have the weakness a deck to exploit it. I also can't use my main deck. What was this one again? The electric one? I could honestly dismantle that one. Propaganda. Mr. G. Dark Charizard. I don't think I have that one. Dark Fire Club. Yeah, you can go nuts with your draws. You can have, like, 58 cards in your hand. Okay, you can't. There's no way to do that. So six cards are prizes. Oh, well, as few as two. You can have as few as two prizes, I think. Um, so two prizes, and then your initial draw is seven cards. you got to put one down. So one on the field, and then two prizes. And you lose if you need to draw a card, but 
you don't lose if you draw your last card, I think. I think you have to need to draw a card after having no cards left to draw. So, theoretically, if you played one card on free pre pre turn one, you had two prizes, you could have 57 cards in your hand and it would be legal. Jess. I wasn't told to do any um, special rolls. That's nice. Staryu seems like it'll be super good if she uses... Um, fuck it, play them all. <gasps> Only one card. It's a Ponyta! Wait, I'm just going to win. I must won one turn. I came damn close to winning in one turn. Master Ball. Okay, so much for that. It's fun while it lasted. Magma Punch. I've got too many water types. You're fucked. Wish I had some plus powers. Oh, that's cute. Come on. That was really easy. If you have the weaknesses, this game is a lot simpler. That Haunter! Yo. That's probably... I don't know, 10 damage is not very much, though. That could do up to 570 damage. I wonder what the highest damage you can do in one turn in Pokemon cards is. Someone's definitely figured that out at some point. Kara. We're supposed to duel. Did she say she was cooking for me? What the fuck did she say? Only fire energy. Well, why does she not remember her fucking lines? Probably would have been better to do this one from the ground up. The modern game is crazy. Pokemon can just regularly have over 200 HP. I don't like, um, and it's, it seems the metagame is fully centered around, like, the double prize Pokemon, or triple prize Pokemon. What does the I mean? What did you do? Who did you kill? Watching without video? Just listening? And it tells you. What kind of world have we come to? That's funny. Well, I guess I'll try some of these Charmanders. Might as well do a Charmeleon deck. I hate that one. That one's super annoying. That one's super annoying. Ponyta's good. I can use Ponyta. And I'm in Ponyta. I could cram some Rapid Ash in there. Maybe some Magmars. Those seem good. Add a bunch of Fire Energies. I don't know how many I'm going to need, but, you know. Might as well just go nuts. I can take out all the fucking normal types. I don't need them. I should leave some in there. I don't need that many energies. Don't need the Spearows. Don't need the Jigglypuff and Wigglytuff. Don't need the Taurus. Did I equip the deck? Alright, let's try that again. Oh, she's cute! No wonder she was stutter stuttering with her lines. She's a child. She looks like the girl from... Tenchi Muyo. With the pigtails. I don't remember if she had pigtails. Maybe I'm just making shit up. That was like a girl with blue hair. 
I got the cute little Charmander. That only uses one energy to attack, right? Yeah, okay, that's a great lead mon, actually. Okay, I hate this. Round start, going for a mon that um, is water type, when the only energy I can have is fire. And I lost a mon turn one. Drew another fire energy, we're good. Alright, 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 things are getting bad. But maybe I can um, not lose on the spot. I don't know how to use the energy on. She's only got the one mon, it's got fucking 10 HP. This is frustrating. I just need to draw a fire energy before she draws another Pokemon. Oh my god, that was clutch as hell. This fight should have been impossible. But we won. I got super, super lucky with that fight. Holy shit. Potion energy is one of my favorites. She's cute. And my favorite NPC so far. Open sesame seeds. Oh, this is the um this is the fire elite form member from the last game. I like how they just expect me to remember all these people, and I like that I actually do. It goes to show that they actually had pretty memorable characters in the first game, even though they only have like a few lines and then a boss fight. Uh four EVs. Do I have Flareon? I can just cram a bunch of EVs and Flareons in my deck. I can leave the Rattatas, honestly. If I have a Flareon, I can just chuck it in there. Dark Flareon, sure. That put me out to the perfect number anyway. She cute! It's a fire and electric deck. Good information. That means I couldn't have just as easily brought a water deck. Charmander. I got the other Charmander. I actually like... I like the other one. Alright. Energy search. Why not? Got my fire energy. Scratch. Energy removal. Keep this thing from boosting. Scratch. Scratch. Nice. Sure would be nice if I had a plus power. Magmar is so ugly, dude. I don't know what I'm doing. Another fire energy. Playing with fire. Which one do I want to set up? I definitely just want to kill this. Let's do that. Alright, well, we're still alive. Things are a little ugly. Which Magmar do I use? They're the same? Okay, they're both that one. And boost either of them. I, I think I win. Good fight. She cute. No, I freed the Dark Venusaur. Do I need one of those? Dark Grass Club? I've never seen it, so I'll look at it. Horrid Pollen. Either asleep and poisoned, confused and poisoned, or paralyzed and poisoned. <laughs> so, always poisoned. I, this is a fucking... This is bad breath from Marlboro. Kino. Cute Fira. Fly high, dodge attacks. Oh, it's like Sword Stance. Can't retreat? Whoa. I don't like it. Whoa. That question. I remember this um this card's uh picture I thought was the coolest thing ever. Because this is just fucking random gem on Dark, uh Golduck's forehead that's just always been there and I've always been like, what does it do? And this picture shows a cool ass fucking beam firing out of it like Dio. Why the fuck does it not do this in the games? Maybe it does. Maybe this is what happens when you click psychic with fucking Golduck. 
Golduck feels like they wanted to make a Water Psychic type in Chickened Out, which is funny because um, they made Water Psychic, they made Starmie and Slowbro in that gen. The thing about Gen 1 is that they knew that Psychic was busted, so they made a lot of Psychic Mons either hard to get or end game. You can't actually get like a Slowbro or a, a Staryu, I think, until you have the Super Rod. Abra's hard to catch. Mr. Mime and Jinx you have to trade for. Um, what are they like? Drowsy? Drowsy's not as good, I guess, so they give that one to you a little bit earlier. In Gen 1, it was just those two. If they made... What I'm saying is if they made Golduck now, it would be Water Psychic. What's another Water Psychic one? Bruxish? Are there that many? I'm struggling to think of that many. Water Psychic. I'm struggling. There's like a... There's probably a big one I'm just not thinking of. There's a lot of water types. Water's the most common type. It's actually more common than normal type. Dark Gloom. I don't like any Mon that can potentially status itself. Cute fucking Meowth. Coin Hurl. I said Starmie. <laughs> I got all of them. My Pokemon power level too high. Aerodactyl, classic. Giovanni? It actually speaks volumes that you can just see this part of his face, which is literally like Toriyama tier fucking Vegeta face, Chrono face, and you can still tell it's Giovanni. Maybe um, Ken Sugimori is actually quite talented. Maybe Pokemon would be nothing without him. Regional Slowpoke? No, that one's um, Water Poison, isn't it? Isn't it? I don't remember. I thought it was. Oh, Poison Psychic. See, I didn't even get it right. I remember poison. Alright, so I ignored the weakness to water. That's fine. I'm just going in with a fire deck anyway. Not being ex able to exploit the weakness is something I've already been doing. Cool Panita. Wow, that sucked. Go a little Charmander. Holy hell, this drawing. She played like 20 billion moves. Do I attack or do I... It was greedy of me to... Alright, so much for that. This is going really badly. This is going really badly. Alright, well, here I go. Here I go. Don't think I can win. I got enough energies to attack, but they got off the fucking agility. That fucking sucked. The plus power is coming in clutch. Alright, let's go with the little Charmander guy. Ponyta. Let's go with Ponyta. Ponyta sets up a little slow. We broke through. God, fuck. All the plus powers. What do I do? I don't think that was the move. Alright, we're hanging on. I 
I already did that. That was a lot of attacks. Play more Magmars. We got, like, draw spam. You can still only put on one energy per turn. I'm not scared. Alright, I'm a little scared. Nice. Clutch fucking dodge. Start setting up the Charmander. What's the rules with that second move? Oh, it all makes sense now. Energy removal is really nice. I would have loved a... Uh, fire energy. Ah, shit. Damn it. I like, can't win anymore. We got a YOLO. Well, I got my fire energy, but I still can't win. Damn it, dude. One, o one off. Literally, if I did 10 more damage. I wish I just had more plus powers. Alright, go little Charmander. Fire energy first turn is good. Flame Tail. I need to get off a bunch of fucking... Um, Energies every turn. Non negotiable. Just deck theme of just drawing like hell. I'm just. I'm 10 damage short so often. Frustrating. Nice. No damage next turn. Nice damage. Agility is busted. I got that going for me. Poison sucks. I do have a full heal. I could still die. Damn it. Alright, Rattata. It's up to you. I'm actually pretty close to winning. But this Ninetales, I don't see how I can possibly beat it. There's just no way. It has such low HP. Yeah. Fucking hell. I haven't lost anyone more than once except this person who I've lost to like a million times. I can't use my grass deck. My water deck doesn't do anything. It's just a bunch of uh, extremely fast, like, setup. Just draw the fuck out of your deck. I need to, like, take more trainer cards into my deck, I think is the only way. Well, that sucked. I need fire energies, damn it. Non-negotiable. Another Ponyta. Ponyta is good. Stomp is two, right? Yeah. Alright, that's, that's better. Need the fire energies. Probably better to go for agility there, actually. I need more energies. Okay, this is horrible. Three EVs, that's right, I can take those out. Well, I'm gonna lose. I 
Alright, let's modify the deck instead of just pushing on. The Rotatas are fine. The Eevee's gotta go. And also the... I need more energies. Dark Flareon's gotta go. What trainer cards? The Evolution Spray for you or the opponent? One of your own Pokemon. I wish I had fucking plus powers. Pokemon Center? More potions might do it. So a couple super potions. No, energies. I need energies. I didn't have enough energies. I wasn't drawing them. Let's give this a go. I could specially build a deck for this, but it seems like it would be a lot of effort and maybe not work. Alright, this is a good starting loadout. I got my Ponyta. I'm just going to not even set up this Rattata. Plus power would be so fucking helpful. Alright, Invincible. That's good. What is it doing? Oh, he's preventing me from drawing. That's super annoying. Alright, things are rapidly shifting right now. I think I'm winning. Did I say? No confused, right? That was lucky. I don't need both of these guys. What do I need? Fire energies? Bill? Bill is actually one of the best things to draw, I think. Energy removal is kind of cool. Alright, keeping the invincibility. Potion is good. Should have drawn a super potion, maybe. Energy search is good. Charmeleon is all set up. Alright, this battle is is looking good. I don't think I can still lose. I think things are going too well. Alright, I shouldn't underrate my opponent's ability to draw out their whole fucking deck in one turn. I never played Pokemon Battle Revolution. Is it so good? Alright, last Mon? Yeah, I've got one prize. It's her last Mon. Everything is going my way. F Rapidash has free retreat? Holy shit. So your retreat cost is busted. Alright, that was super hard. Dark Golbat. Have I had that one? Don't think so. What? Doesn't look that good. I feel like this is... I think Golbat still does this. Or Crobat does. But it's like better. It's like more damage. It like has attack steam around not attacking the mod in front of it. I could have a completely different playthrough of this game every time I play it. Digger. Whoa, I can just scroll like that? I don't think the first game had that. Wait, I didn't actually look at Digger. This is goofy. I don't like it. Cute slowpoke. Afternoon nap and headbutt. That's quite good. That's not. Not a good card. Another Aerodactyl. Dark Cadabra, which I don't think I had and I think I needed. No, I needed Alakazam. Oh yeah, didn't I need a Dark Flareon? Fire Coin. The Fighting Fortress. I haven't even thought about building a Psychic deck. It's probably doable. What's up with the Dark John Shell? Have I actually been here? I don't think I did.
Gen Z. Don't I have that? Gen Z. Okay. I have so many trades I need to do. Right now we're in recess. Do I really have to put them in separately? Oh, there's actually a sprite for fucking putting the coins in. That's hilarious. There's no side path in this one. Man named Brutus. Which is here. Tony and Grace. Our labyrinth. Okay. <laughs> Fighting energy card. This is like an RPG all of a sudden. With a chest. Kino. Alright, I'm gonna do the same thing I do in every um, labyrinth, which is make left turns. Oh. Found something. Probably should stop using this fire deck. Um, let me... Let me use the grass one. I still only have like half the cards in the game. Look at that, 255 out of 443. Wait. No energy removal. He's gonna do that to me so much. Alright, this one didn't have any energy removal in it, right? Or maybe it did. Is it this one? Oh my god, I have energy removal in all three decks. Only one. Chucking in another water energy, fuck it. I don't like this guy's face. Okay. I definitely should have brought my grass deck. I'm playing a little hard and loose. And I lost. Alright, this time I drew a Starmie, so I won't lose, probably. fucked if that happens. Oh, that would have been nice. I drew a Magikarp. We're going to win because I have the Magikarp. Got to set up the Magikarp and then I'll be able to win. This Magikarp is my ticket to victory. Fuck it, set up the Magikarp. I'll just sit on remaining energies. I hate that. I'm weak to, um... Where the fuck is my one Gyarados? Oh, I drew another Magikarp. We're good. Wait. I can just draw it. Oh my god. Oh my god. I take back everything bad I said. This card is fucking insane now. This is like maybe the best card ever. Magikarp is insane and good. I just win. Oh my god. Magikarp with the clutch. Clutch as fuck. I thought I was just being dumb by giving energy to that Magikarp. I thought I was just living on a prayer. But actually I was giving myself an extremely good chance of victory. I don't think I've seen that Kangaskhan. Ah, um, another one of those. Oddish. It's cute. Wow. Just hands out statuses. Sleep if you need to stall, poison if you need to win. Should be Magiku now. Different Kakuna with rollout. Which I don't think it. No, Kakuna definitely doesn't learn rollout. Kakuna only has like four moves. 
It's Poison Sting, Harden, Bug Bite, and String Shot, and I think Electro Web, actually. So I think five moves. Someone double check. Someone fact check me on Kakuna's moveset. Poison Sting, String Shot, Harden, Electro Web, Bug Bite. I think that's it. Weedle. Cute shell there. It's just Water Gun, but with a different name. Nidoran Mail. I hate Nidoran Mail. Oh, I hate this Nidoran Mail especially. Why did they just do this? High power Pokemon with low success rate. Texture Magic at 3D attack. It's a cool Porygon, not a regular Porygon. That's kind of good. Alright, Electro Web is probably the one I made up then. I named five. Oh, that's not a room I can go to. Alright, right turns. I mean, left turns. Uh, only if it's King of Fighters 15. Oh, a whole fucking... Oh, I got Chansey. I need to trade that motherfucker. Oh, Beedrill doesn't learn Electroweb. Dark Hypno. Didn't I need that? According to my notes, no I did not. It's cool looking. There was a time that Hypno was in more porn than any other Pokemon, but I think that time has passed. I think we have enough, like, you know, just furries now. That we've moved on to, like, Lucario or something. Alright, what's your gimmick? Fighting type only. Alright, time to dismantle one of my decks, I guess. Which am I dismantling? Fire one is kind of fun. Water is good because it beats fire, which beats grass, which is my main one. I guess I can build a new deck. I got room for four. I just don't have that many normal types to put in it. How many fighting energies do I have? Please be a lot. Oh, 34. Let's just chuck 20 in there and then we'll just fill out whatever. That's a good mom. I don't know if those are good, but I'm going to put them in. This one's funny. That much up. It's better. I'll do some of each. This is Machoke? I thought it was Machop. Fuck it. Do I have Machamp? I have Dark Machamp. No, this one's really good. I want that one. Oh, Dark Machoke and Machoker, they have different rules. I didn't realize that you could have both. Part of me wishes? What? You would just be, like... You would be in the same boat as everyone if you just wished they stayed Sprite. I mean, the 3D looks fine. Better than it did in the trailer of 14, anyway. But it's such a common opinion to think that it looked better when it was Sprite work. You can just say that. No one's going to judge you. I'll chuck some Geodudes in there. Fuck it. Who needs trainer cards? We're all going to make it, bro. This will be the E deck. And I will use it. The double color sends you kind of against me. In that case, I want the other Machop, I think. That one's not so good with that double colorless energy.
Whoa, she was cute. The stupid looking manky or the stupid looking manky. I think I will leave the stupid looking manky. Alright, I'm relieved to not see a psychic Pokemon. I think I will do some mischief. I got punched. Alright, well, I think I will do some anger. That would have been nice if I hit it. I will do some more mischief. I think I will do some more anger. I need it to hit. Alright, we got it. And I lost. Alright, well that sucked. Not enough basics in my deck, perhaps. St. True is fine. We both only have one Mon. And she has a fucking flying Mon. Alright, so much for this. GG. Oh, I can force her to flip anyway, right? Yeah. Never mind. All right, if she draws a Spiro, I lose. She's got to have her win and never draw a Spiro. Oh, she's got Scyther, too. I'm utterly and completely fucked. I just can't win. I need Gust of Wind. It's like the only way. Whoa, I didn't didn't put enough energy on. Well, I guess I'll do my 10 damage Karate Chop. I guess I'll power up a Diglett. Like I'll ever use it. So long, little Diglett. Alright. Sure have no chance of winning. I did uh, two heads and barely got enough to do 10 damage. I need to draw like a Doug Trio now or sooner. This is almost a little frustrating. Alright, go little Diglett. Oh, that Doug Trio. How many do I have in my deck? I drew a Geodude. That would have been nice a little while ago. And I lose. It's pretty annoying to bring a fighting deck to bring Mons that resist fighting to like a, a match where I'm forced to use fighting Mons. I should have brought a bunch of normal types. I should have known something like this would happen. I just wanted to use like... Alright, that... that Dark, Dark Machoke can be the, the clincher actually. Oh, I knew that. Oh, I got knocked back. Alright, well, GG. Mega Punch. Alright, we just um, keep on wailing at him. Oh, I didn't have the energy. Alright, we just keep on wailing at him. I need a Mon with decent attack. I got Dark Dug Trio. How many energies does that need? Two. Right, that one has damage potential. I need an energy soon. I got it. Nice 30. I like can't win <laughs> with this deck. I need just normal types. Alright, let's stop fucking around and actually cram some in. I was all excited to use all of my chops. I'm super mad. All the fucking radicates and stuff are in my other one. Whatever, we'll do these Rattatas. I'll try the Jigglypuff Wigglytuff thing.
Make some computer searches. I don't have any. Alright. Check the, um, my chop spec in. The geodudes and the gravelies were the ones I should have checked back in. Like, this is better for this fight, but it's still not a good fight. I need to use just, like, mons that are just... You have to, like, actually counterpick in this game. Kangaskhan is, like, the god lead in all of Pokemon cards. You just set up really fucking fast. That being said, it's weak to fighting. That's especially annoying, actually. This is fighting and flying. That's actually a super strong meta, like, deck. Because if I have to use it with a fighting deck, the fighting beat normal and the flying beat fighting. Look how much damage that did to me. Drew my Spearow. Oh, I should not have gone into this. Oh, he killed me. Alright, we're playing hard and loose right now. Alright, this Spiro will win me the whole thing. And he went to Firo. Alright, Rattata, do your worst. Oh, I lost. Uh, I got Jigglypuff and Wigglytuff. Alright, one card only. This is my hope. Geodude. Nice. And a Graveler. What's going on here? Still only one card. I think I had to go Wigglytuff, though. It doesn't kill me. No, it does kill me, doesn't it? It does not kill me. I got a Friendship Song again and pray. Please work. Damn it. That would have been nice. Well, we go tough it is. And then we do the wave for all 20 damage. And I lose? Oh, now I get a fucking... God damn it. I should have just been setting this thing up. Wait. Did I just win? He didn't draw anything! She didn't draw anything. Oh my god. Alright, well I just got completely lucky. No basics for the opponent. I mean, that can happen, right? My actual favorite Pokemon card of all time is called Blank's Chansey. It's called Your Name's Chansey. It's just a blank space where you can write your name. And it's a Chansey uh, hatching from an egg. I think it's established that humans eat Pokemon here or there. I think there's at least some Pokemon that are eaten by humans. I mean, Pokemon just replace animals in the Pokemon verse. Anything that animals happen happens to animals in the real world happens to Pokemon in the Pokemon world. That's a cool Pikachu. That's a cool Squirtle. Sway. They, they're show needing Magikarp, or attempting to eat Magikarp in the show. I remember that. Big trio. That was a profoundly frustrating fight. The game is getting harder. I got trolled! I didn't know there would be pits. I probably took the most direct route. Oh my god. Alright. New plan. Save states. Dark Charizard, I got it. Unfortunately, I have to trade this away right away. But we can look at it anyway. Continuous Fireball, 50 damage times. Ugh. You have to discard for every heads. 
And you probably have to flip for every uh, thing and not just have many you want to use. Very double-edged. Key magic card. Kaboo tops. I think I've probably explored everything at this point. Hi. Oh, did I ever go straight up here? Okay. It looks like I took the most direct route somehow. It forces you to go loop-de-loops. Whoa. I wanted to go here, and then here. Whoa, no. Here and then here. I've already done this. Oh no, but I was not past the warp. Okay, I'm back here. Oh, here's the other entrance. Alright, so there's one room I missed. I think. This is going to be really hard with super speed. That's here. So eventually I want to cut down, maybe like now, yep, promotional diglet, well hidden, peck, gives you a little kiss, rolling movement, that's fine, wait I didn't look at his health, I probably explored everything, can I please use my regular deck? Please, just let me use it. Ignore resistance. That's... I could have been exploiting that, maybe. Oh, I could have brought my own flying types to that one fight. I should have known. That didn't occur to me. Alright. We just rock this thing really fast with the Bulbasaur. Drew my Grimer. I didn't mean to do that. That energy does nothing. That's annoying. Well, that's an energy gone forever. Oh, Penisaur. I forgot I had this thing. And it actually requires four energies. Alright, fucking Kino. Probably good to just kill this thing. Might as well evolve my Grimer so I can oak. Alright, this fight is going super well. He Imakunied? Jesus Christ! Imakuni confuses the user. He deliberately fucking. Oh, please. Yes! How much damage? Oh my god, that was lucky. I would have taken 70. He took 50 instead, which is the number I think I came up with. When trying to figure out how strong it would be when it was tactical well confused. That was pretty nice. Oh, he energy removal me twice. I can't even attack anymore. Alright, well, I got all my energies back, but... Did he just not sword stance? Baffling decision. Uh, this is, I think, weak to grass. I think that's also weak to grass. Alright, well that fight was amazingly easy considering how hard the last two were. Another Bill's Teleporter. Dark Alakazam. I need regular Alakazam. Fighting Coin. Wait. What about this door? Where does this door go? Oh, you go... Oh. Wait, that was the boss. 
That's why he gave me the coin. Alright, what's going on in Ishihara's house? Who the fuck are you? Is this like Ishihara's fucking sex mansion? What's the color of this altar? Two coins. So there is a colorless coin. Is this the whole place? Kind of small. All three of us. This is really annoying. Four Pidgeys. Alright, well, I'm just gonna move, I'm just gonna pick four cards and just swap them every time they have some fucking requirement for me. I wanna save this one. I like it so much. What do I kill? The two Penisaurs? I have the Dark Penisaur too now. Bruh. Bruh. The Scyther. Do I even have four Pidgeys? They're all in like some other deck. I gotta like find where the Pidgeys are and free them. I'll take out one of the Grammars. Oh, I've got to fucking put in four holdover cards. Four Charmanders. Alright, where the fuck are my Pidgeys? Do I even have any? I keep on accidentally equipping the decks. I don't have any Pidgeys! I need four Pidgeys in the deck and I have one Pidgey. I need more Pidgeys. Wait, I was not prepared for this fucking instance. Now what? I gotta go and just fight someone somewhere. I haven't been to Pokemon Dome in a minute. This is just an issue I didn't think I would run into. What's the minicom? I have mailbox. Too many words. I thought that would be a... Uh... There we go. Alright, I need a lot of Pidgeys right now from all these. Never mind, only a couple of them even have. Whoa! Energy deck. I mean, energy. View card catalog. Here it is. Yeah, I only have one Pidgey. This is just an issue I didn't think I would run into. Game FAQs. Pokemon trading card game. Oh no. Is it not here? Oh no, no, no. I refuse to believe it's not here. I don't care if it's Japan only. Pokemon card GB2 is the name of it on game FAQs. D 
D38s is a Pidgey. So which which one is D? Where's the computer? Assault? Assault. How do I get assault decks? That's a lot of these. 40 out of 50, 48 out of 50, 12. I haven't gotten any flights. I'm pretty close to getting Premier Complete, though. The word Assault isn't even in here. do this. What's the name of it? It's called Assault, right? Uh, they must have a different name in Japanese. Uh, it's called the Mr. Mind. No. Yeah, Mr. Mind Pack. Batoru. Cho Batoru. Who has the fucking. That one? I can just beat people until I find it. That's a method. I think Amanda from the Water Club, based on this guide, might give the right one. And that would be super well and good. Are you Amanda? No. I, I need... I'm going to save state once I get the pack and just manipulate the RNG like that. Get Pidgeys. Turn one poison. Charmander, I forgot I threw that in there just now. Might as well go Dark Muck. It's free. Alright, well, I shouldn't have played this. Just let it die, I suppose. Go, go, go. All right, muck fucking swept. All right, save state. All right, that's the Mr. Mime one. So now what? I just look for fucking Pidgeys. This is a sad, sad, sorry state. Was that the same deck? I think it was. Oh, no. It doesn't reroll RNG like the first game. All right, well, I just have to beat her over and over. This Charmander is doing me no favors. Sorry, it has scratch. Never mind, it doesn't. 
Best arrow it is. If you're a Weedle. There we go. I like the part where I put an energy on this Charmander, just hoping it would do something. I thought it was the other Charmander. I didn't mean to stiffen. Ah. Uh, that's not good. I'm poisoned now. Oh, no. Oh, no, no. I'm going to lose because of that. Oh. I lost. It's a draw. Forgot that could happen. That answers what could have happened that one time. It's your only Pokemon. Probably just win right now, but you know. She has Gust of Wind, I should stop playing the Charmanders. And I won. Alright, give me Pidgeys. I can't believe I'm doing this. I've got a lot of chances of getting Pidgey each time, so it's not a huge deal. And she seems like she might be kind of, like, you know, easy. Do I still have the electric deck? I think I took it apart. I think I got fighting, fire, water, and grass right now. Alright, sticky fingers. This Mr. Mime deck is the one with the Pidgeys in it. So I'm going to need some Pidgey stat. I can't believe I'm farming. I can't believe I need three Pidgeys. This is so stupid. It must be really common. It must be really strange that I don't have them. Well, she has. She seems to have very few basics in her deck because I keep on winning like way before. Can I please get some Pidgeys? I haven't found one yet. There's way too many cards in this game, as it turns out. Kingler, don't like you having any energies at all. Salt water, what the fuck does that do? Whoa, he drew like a million fucking water energies. That's pretty funny. But also, uh, wow, I hate this. He killed a tentacle. Play the Weedle. Put grass energy on the Weedle. Kill the tentacle? I don't want to switch. Sixty won't even be enough. Am I just fucked? I'm a little caught off guard here. Well, that's a really good card. Damn it. I thought I had one less HP than it does. Alright. If I get a clutch flip here, I win. I didn't. Sorry, I'd win anyway. Wait, I didn't win. Why didn't I win? Did she switch? What's going on? Can I please get heads? I'm starting to get all nervous. Alright, let's stop fucking around. Just go into the Ivysaur. Just hit it with Vine Whip. We win. Moonstone. I finally get to see what this is. Just auto evolution of whatever. get a mysterious fossil instantly. I got Pidgey. Found one. A mere Pidgey. I don't know if you can double up the cards in a booster pack. I don't know if you can get repeats. Alright, only Charmanders. That's pretty bad luck. And I got a Bulbasaur. I need him to kill me fast. I'm going to be honest, I do not like that he has that fucking Kingler back there. I 
Okay, he missed the flip. This mod actually sets up pretty slowly if it doesn't get that flip. And uh, this one thankfully also didn't get the flip. Because that would have been catastrophic. Surprisingly hard fight. Can I get a plus power? I got one. Right. I hate this. Maybe I'll just do this off stream. I should like leave anyway. It's 8 a.m. Might just do this on my own time. How stupid it is. My run has just stopped fucking as long as I can't get a, a Pidgey. Whack as hell. Playing with fire. I can keep my HP high. I keep on playing Charmanders. Why am I doing that? Okay, I won. Pidgeotto. Oh, another Pidgey. Alright, we're in there. We only need one more. Alright, I'm feeling it. Weedle. Alright, turn one poison. But she drew. Which is less than ideal. I need her to not draw any fucking basics. That's how I win. Got the poison, clutch poison. And now I think I win, right? Yeah. Why even check? It saves me time. Moonstone again. No Pidgeys. Run on fucking hostage until I get enough Pidgeys. I could have done this without a guide. I can just look up um, which deck has the Pidgey in it, which I did. Well, I kind of did, but I could have looked at it in the computer. Alright, plus power is still not enough. Okay, I hate this. I would love a poison, like now or sooner. I got it. Clutch poison, coming in hot. Professor Oak sounds kind of nice to maybe get a... Didn't get it. Can I energy move from something else? Oh, this is his only mom. GG. Pidgey, Pidgey, Pidgey. That's not a Pidgey. Sure is nice farming these packs. Got the poison. Did not mean anything. Got the poison again. Rude plays stiffen. Didn't matter. Actually, it was better what I did. What I did was smart. I'm gonna build up another Weedle. Fuck it. I don't think it'll matter. Build up the Bulbasaur. I don't know. Can I please get some heads? I'm tired of all these tails. What's going on with the fucking tentacle cowardice? So it can retreat at will, but why does it get healed? Why does it get healed? I get the cowardice part, but where's the heal part? What's funny is I just, like, you know, win. Alright, I'll just play the drill. That's one way to win. I was looking for plus power. Pidgey, Pidgey, Pidgey. Oh, I got it. 
Four Pidgeys acquired. That was so stupid. I better have all the fucking um, C's and D's. I'm still missing a bunch. Of both. Those are the two I was farming. Alright. For whatever reason, I'm not leaving yet. Even though I def definitely should. Because I'm tired as hell and because I want to do something today. And I won't be able to if I just sleep. Alright, the Charmander's out. The Pidgey is not even useless, that's the funny thing. It's bad, but it's not useless. It's more useful than Charmander. I've got the relevant energies for it. I've got your fucking Pidgeys, dude. Gonna beat your ass with Pidgey if I have to. This Bulbasaur is alarmingly good. Okay, I hate that. Um, I can guess to win him to get rid of the food counters. Oh, he's just bringing Snorlax, huh? Sure, it'd be nice if I had some fucking... He doesn't have energies either, though. And he woke up instantly. Alright, well, let's bring in this one. Sure, it'd be nice if I had some fucking... Uh... Alright. I didn't want to play the Pidgey. Let's do the Professor Oak. Oh, I should have done the plus power. I forgot I... Ah, oh, fuck. This is his strat? Just remove all my energies? I can energy retrieve them. Dank. I can spam one of the Pidgeys to do it. Extremely dank. Okay. Let me think. No, there's nothing to think about. I don't have enough power. That's why I use the plus power. This guy just brought in a million mons with a shitload of HP. I definitely should use my fighting deck here. This is like my chance for it to do some work. Get Grimer to do something. Again, with the fucking energy removals. He probably has, like, six. Good thing I have so many fucking energies in my deck. He has no energy. He's energy starved, too. He's, like, more energy starved than I am. Oh, the scoop up. Kino. Got the poison. I'm not even mad. The super energy removal again. Make it stop. He's played like five energy removals now. And I won. That was a horrible, horrible fight. The Pidgeys, thankfully, didn't hold me back. Mewtwo, it's cool looking. All of your opponent's Pokemon. It's a pretty funny card. Seems decent. Cadaver, I yes, Cadaver's decent too. It's got the same attack. Super Psy, same pack, exact everything. I don't think I've seen that Parasect. Poison Spore and Leech Life. Ah, if it wasn't 20, this would be good. If it was like 30 or 40. That was a hellish fight. Dr four Dratinis? That's really easy to just swap. My fear is that I don't have four Dratinis, but I think I do. I have five. I 
And of course, I studied with Jatini. I didn't want to play it. I'd rather sacrifice it if I had to. Alright, I've already drawn two Dratinis. Should not have used my energy card. Uh, touch the Onyx. Alright, this is a decent start, actually. How's this guy doing? He's got already an evolved Pokemon. Dark Clefable, scary. Jigglypuff is super scary. Also Hitmonchan. A lot of scary mons. I don't want to guess something in. The Hitmonchan? It's not it's not the normal Hitmonchan. I don't know what it is. Which of these mons I'm the most, most afraid of? I want to get that in before it's got all its energies. Might punch. I'll get my chance to beat it up. The Super Potion. Well, I got all my life back. Oddly. A lot of weird shit is happening. Can I guess the wind that... Oh, there was no... I thought there was a... I don't know what to fucking do. A lot of energies and nothing to really put them on. Here we go. Okay, rep failed. I, it, I think it breaks this fight to do 40 damage in one go. I can gust of wind in something that I can kill in one hit and just kill it. Alright. If there's a Pidgey in here, I will flip. There wasn't. This is this guy gave me two of the same deck. Also, I got a Pidgey. I could have farmed him and it would have been faster. Alright, what's your gimmick? Four dark Pokemon cards. There must be some dark grass Pokemon. I've already got two dark mucks, right? I can just make it three. I've got three dark mucks. And then dark dark Venusaur just does it. And then I guess I'll chuck in a grass energy just cause. I made my deck better. Dude, this is like this is literally my deck isn't even worse. Alright. Weedle. Weedle looks good. I have no energies at all. No energies at all. We got the actual in-game counter pick. I have two Professor Oaks on the fucking first draw, which is horrible. Um, what's this Pidgey like? It's got Quick Attack. That's scary. Kakuna now doesn't feel good, though. I think I'll just plus power and just Poison Sting and whatever happens, happens. Alright, we lived. Now this fucking Weedle has a chance to do some work. Stiff and failed. That is a... Alright, let's do this. We're going crazy go nuts right now. Am I double colorless? Bill. My Bulbasaur is ready to do some work. Except for all the fact that I don't have any energies. Wait a sec, I'm winning. Oh, the mirror move. Alright, give me a grass energy soon. Oh, I energy retrieval. Duh. I don't need all these dark mucks. 
Donk. Oh, I won. GG. Gengar, Poliwhirl. It's that one that diddles, or whatever. What does it do? It twiddles. Computer Switch is a pretty good card. Colorless coin. I'm at quite a few coins now. I guess the game is over once I get 24 coins. Probably once I complete my folder. That's me, I'm the Polyworld Diddler. Okay, this is like the final regular area. Psychic is usually really annoying. Dark Hypno. I think I have that one. Got the Cyber Mewtwo. This is always one of my favorite cards. It's super cool. You bring it out after you've already done some discarding of your Psychic Energies. And then, yeah, two energies from your discard pile attached to the Mewtwo. And then all of a sudden you're ready to do Cyber and sets up pretty fast. Wait, I didn't even go in. What? What is this? What? How do I make it go? Wait right there. Okay. Claire? Clyde, Victoria, oh, this is number four. I thought she was number four. Kevin, Heidi, just gotta beat them all. No trainer cards. I think I did that for one of them. It's this one. Alright, fuck it. I'm just going in. Oh, but it's a fighting deck. This is going to be hellish. I'll just see what happens, because, you know, who knows what she's going to bring. Could be anything. Alright, it's Abra. Oh, it's this. It's this King is gone. I thought it was the other one. Oh, I resist. I resist Ghost. I resist Psychic. Holy shit. Alright. There's hope. This is actually like the dream mon. What's my other attack and do I even want it? Tail drop. And I need two heads in a row. Oh, she has the Slowbro, doesn't she? Fuck the Slowbro. I hate that Slowbro. It's a good-ass card. It can move... Um, it can move damage counters around. But I bet nothing can even hurt me, honestly. This thing is like struggling to wound me. That thing did zero. I guess I'll build up a Machop. I don't really have much else to do. Killed the Slowbro, and I won. Wow. Kangaskhan fucking killed her. Just instantly won. Dark Gyarados. A lot of darks. Hill energy. Six Ghastly and Haunter. <laughs> that should be doable. Take out some of the um, fighting mons, I suppose. The Machokes. Take out all the psychic mons, I mean fighting mons. Just have this not even be a fighting deck anymore. Please, please, please have haunters. Of course, I got like a million of them. I don't like that one. I don't really like that one either. I can live with that one.
I got four different Haunters. Oh, this one's Kino. I want this one. I guess I'll leave some fighting energies in there. Doesn't matter that much. Some trainer cards would probably make it better, but whatever. Alright, my Rattata. Kangaskhan is probably going to win instantly. Because I've got four energies already to set it up. And he put himself to sleep turn one. Put me to sleep. Even if he eats my dreams, is it that bad? I woke up. He's got a really low chance of... Wait. Oh, he did something to put me to sleep. But yeah, I need. he needs like a... He has so many different ways of, wake, of putting me to sleep. Holy shit, I just realized. It's kind of annoying. Adam awake. Get punched, idiot. Okay, nice punching. get punched, but this time let's... Mm. I needed a lot of fucking tails. I needed three heads and I had eight flips and I didn't get three heads. Okay. I'm 12 flips deep now. Okay, this whole deck is just put you to sleep deck. It's working. Can we get some heads? Thank you. Oh my god, I stayed asleep. Dude, this is... Fuck. What's Dark Fear I need? Alright, I'm already good. Alright, I'm awake. Sure, set up the Jigglypuff. Oh my god, it feels like my... Luck isn't very good. Sure, give the Rattata energy cards. This thing can't hurt me. Alright, I need to kill this. Please, give me some heads. Okay, he has transparency. That's scary. Wigglytuff. Don't mind if I do. Alright, that thing is going to win me the game. Why not put a fighting energy on it? My deck actually just kind of picks this whole deck. But I have to get these heads easier said than done. Four tails. That was the normal amount, so I can't complain. This would be the most frustrating thing imaginable if not for the fact that I utterly resist him. I just happen to have like a counter pick. Eventually he's going to draw his deck out, I feel. What's going on here? He's got 16 cards left to draw. I could actually get him to draw out. That would be hilarious. Finally. Luck. Oh, I finally drew one of my Ghastlies. And then also another. So I can just, like, retreat and Wigglytuff and win, right? Whoa. Can we do the wave? Wigglytuff is like the fastest setup you, you can have in old TCG. It's insane. On turn 2 you can have a Wigglytuff doing Do the Wave, and it can do 60 damage per hit. So have a shitload of basics, double colorless energy. Just draw out your deck as fast as possible and just smash through with Do the Wave spam. That was a pretty funny fight. Cool Scyther, holy shit. Oh, that's... That's cruel. And it has a retreat cost too. That's horrible. You can only attack once every two turns. Got another gust of wind. Only psychic energy. I'm just going to use the same ass deck, but I'm going to take out the fighting energies and put in trainer cards, I guess. 
these restrictions are super annoying, but I appreciate that they actually do force you to, like, use the deck building mechanic. You know, in the original game, you basically just build decks to exploit weaknesses, otherwise you just ignore it. Alright, my hand is really stupid. Jigglypuff? That's actually a good starting mon, I guess. It'll help me draw out some mons. Do I resist dark? I mean, I uh, psychic, that's what I meant. And I do. Did he just move one of my energies? Just cut that out. Has he gotten every flip to move my energies around? I should just have so many energies that it won't mean anything. That's annoying. Oh, he can hurt me. What the fuck? Oh no, this is that one. Oh no, never mind, it's not. It's not that one. Yeah, let me look at my two haunters. It's the same haunter twice. It's this one. That one seems good. You can kill me, I don't care. That bypasses resistance, though. That's right. Psychic mods are weak to psychic. But I think this one has no weaknesses. Yeah. Please have no retreat cost. Please, please, please. One. I can live with that. Confuse or sleep him? Or switch? I think switching is the way. My king is gone active. This is a really troublesome fight. What Super Fang do? Hyper Fang. It's 50. That's annoying. That could just kill me. <sighs> he missed the flip. I think now I just attack with it. Oh, I don't have enough energy. I guess I'll throw one more on. Damage potential is higher. I think now just two gnaws is fine. No, I don't want to do that. Spiro, sure. What are you weak to? Electric. I don't know what to put these energies on. The Kangaskhan? Whatever. I don't know what's going on in this fight. It's weird. Mind shock. It did something to me. How does the super potion work again? Two energies? One energy. That's kind of good. Fuck it, I'll do it. I don't need all three of them. Uh, can I win? Is there a way to win? Hunter can't win. Wait! Hunter can win, right? You're weak to Psychic? Yeah. Hunter just wins. Go, Hunter, go. Hunter clutched it out. He's so cute. That was a really hard fight. I think I got lucky. Dark Dragonite. Super cool. Summon minions? Two basic Pokemon? Holy shit, that's really good. Almost every two-stage evolution is good. Pokemon cards are better the higher evolution they are. Like, regardless. So it's really goofy that like a mon like um, Butterfree is ten times better than a mon like Zapdos, but that's how it is. 
on him now. I can do the fourth fight if I want to. I kind of want to. What's your gimmick? I'm okay with that. What the fuck? Yes, I got ghastly. And he's missing tail drops. I love this. Oh, I'm an idiot. I should have played that energy on myself. Holy hell. That's the RNG to make up for how shit my RNG was earlier. Alright, bring in the Kino Haunter. I just need some heads. Alright, that was some heads. Haunter kills this, I think. Right? Yeah. Um, cut that out. Uh, okay. This kind of seems good for me. You're weak to this, right? Yeah. Alright, Haunter is, like, Ghost Pokemon actually beat Psychic Pokemon super well. I'm a bit surprised to see how, how well it's working. And that's bad. I was a psychic, but I think he has the thing where he just just does damage to me. Game doesn't care. Maybe he doesn't. Um how does Dark Fear work? I only need one more ice. No, Ghost has... Psychic does neutral damage to Ghost, but Gengar line is part poison type, so Psychic is super effective to it. Um, you're also remembering that Ghost moves in Gen 1, Psychic mods were immune to Ghost moves, which was just a bug. Ghost was supposed to be super effective to Psychic, but that actually made an immunity instead. So Ghost was the supposed counter to Psychic Mons, but they just completely shit the bed on implementing it. But there was only one Ghost move anyway, it was Lick. Technically there was another Ghost move, it was, um... Uh, I think Confuse Ray was Ghost. And then also, um, Nightshade was Ghost, but Nightshade is fixed damage and Confuse Ray is a status move. Lore. I think I just bite this and then go into Firo. Wait, I didn't actually look at Firo's ability. Alright. Wait, how many energies? Two. Alright, do I already have that? Yeah. So I bite it, and then I switch into Firo. And then I just win with Drill Dive. God, that was close, but I won. I got Penisaur. <laughs> the elevator's already working, so my switch won't do anything. So you've arrived. Is it Rod? Rod's been fucking... Helping us, helping her kidnap people. Yep. Claire affiliated with... Wait. Whoa. We keep the energy cards. I should have brought a different um, deck and not this one, because that's no restriction. But then again, being immune to... Um... Alright, that's annoying. I guess I just pound her. Maybe in the far off future there's a universe where I draw a Wigglytuff and a whole bunch of basics. This normal deck is weirdly great. I've literally got like a counterpick deck to fucking psychic decks. Super energy re removal. It's annoying. I have like way too many fucking um I have way too many energies in my deck, so it does nothing really.
That was a lot of energies I just had removed. I have energy retrieval. Oh, that's right. If any of my mons get knocked out, energy cards return to the hand. So that's why energy retrieval is so important, or energy removal is so important in this fight. Just keep them in the hand for now. The item finder is super fucking annoying. That withdraws, I mean, that, that pulls back, um cards that are discarded. She's going to keep these three psychic energies too. This is a very troll fight. I shouldn't I shouldn't like load up anyone. All right, we just wait patiently for the day that I eventually draw my Wigglytuff. I energy removal this one, I think. That way she can't attack. So much for that. Gust of Wind would be really good in this fight. Oh, she drew out her deck. She actually drew out her deck. I OCB'd with Jigglypuff. Kino, Soul. Amir Jigglypuff. Oak's Imposter's Revenge? There's another one of these two. There's like three Imposter Oak cards, I think. Psychic Coin. Find and defeat the king. Oh, he gave me a special Dragonite with a bag. Special delivery! And a fucking 50-50 attack. I can't believe how easy that fight ended up being. So now I've just got the GR Castle, huh? Am I really just going to beat the game in one sitting? Ronald. And he just forces me into a boss fight. Classic Ronald. Right, if I can poison this turn one, I'm sitting really good. And I can't, so I, I'm not. I got a Penisaur, though. Penisaur is good. Oh my god. These poisons add up fast, so it's annoying when I don't get them. There we go. Got one. What? Did he kill something? Did he force me to switch? What happened? Somehow he just destroyed my fucking Kakuna. Okay, so it's back in my hand. And also everything attached to it. Okay, that could be worse. And I'm confused. Yellow. Nice. Nice Gengar, idiot. Hope you had fun with it. Damn. Do I bother to potion? I think he's doing 30 per hit. 
What does Poltergeist do? Counts my trainers? Something like that. I guess I could spend my energy retrieval. And my... I can get rid of two at once. He nightmared me. So much for that. I don't want to kill myself, so I'm just going to do nothing. Ah, that's what a cock tease. I got my Venusaur. I think it's better to sit on it, and that way I can evolve to dodge status. Alright, I think it's good to evolve. So how does this work? Mega Drain plus plus power should be enough. And I'm going to get a lot of HP back too. Oh, baby. What's this guy's plan even? Kind of looks like he's just going to lose. Kind of looks like the plan is to lose. Killing the Dratini is tempting. And Mega Drain. Okay, he got all heads. I'm not mad because I'm winning. That did a lot, but I've already won. You got as lucky as you could possibly get, motherfucker. But this Ghastly will die. Super Energy Retrieval. Nice penultimate boss fight, like fucking Wally at the end of Victory Road. How long was my mouse on the screen? Three of them? Clay, Allison. Alright, so three bosses. Moltres, Articuno, Zapdos, and Dragonite. I don't have those. Alright, this is a great excuse to not beat the game right now. Because that's a series of boss fights to unlock them, if I understand things correctly. Wait, maybe I do already have them. I don't even have a Moltres at all. Okay, you can't just get them in this game. I wasn't given them at any point. So now that I've saved Rod, I should have the, this area unlocked. Yeah. So beating these four gives me the legendary Pokemon cards, and I need to build a deck with all of them. I'll just clean up this game next time I play. I'm going to go to bed. It's been fun. Five hours? Holy shit. I was really on, on fucking... I don't know. Maybe I'll cut it up when I put it on YouTube.